Sziasztok! Szép estét kívánok! Üdvözlök mindenkit ezen a csütörtök estén. Folytatni fogjuk a Forgotten city amivel annyiban aggódok egy kicsit, hogy hát múlt héten volt, ugye, de azért vannak, vannak már egy kicsit homályosabb foltok. Remélem azért, azért emlékezni fogok arra, amire emlékeznünk kell, de meglátjuk. Jó? Um, folytatjuk, megnézzük, hogy uh, mi van az inventory-ba. Um, úgy nagyjából emlékszem, hogy mit kellene csinálni, hogy mi legyen a következő lépés. Uh, meglátjuk. Jó? Sziasztok, szép estét kívánok mindenkinek. Uh, szerintem nézzük is meg. Oké. Okay. Um, igen, az biztos, hogy, hogy újjá életünk, mármint hogy hát nem, nem újjá életünk, mert meg se haltunk, hanem ugye ott fejeztük be, hogy visszajöttünk az elejére a, a dolognak. Um, várjatok csak, hogy tudom. Um, nem ezt akarom. Nem is ezt. Um, hogy tudom előven? Igen. Oké. Okay. Jó, van nálunk pénz. Ugye pénz kell... Um, igen, a két inast akartuk kiváltani. Viszont az a probléma, hogy szerintem a két inast kiváltani... Igen. Viszont ahhoz fejénként kell egy ezres ha jól emlékszem, és még kell hozzá valami gyant, nem gyanta, hogy megmentsük az életét a másiknak, ami most szerintem nincs nálunk. De van. Ugye ez a, ez a rezinkel, a nagy fejemtől nem látjátok, vagy nem rezinkel? Na mindjárt megkérdezzük, mert József itt elmegy majd. Salve, friend. Mind telling me who you are and what you're doing with that bow on your back? Oh, sounds serious. I'm listening. Ugye egyrészt... Oké, okay, akkor van nálunk Szilfium. Jó, csak mert ezt ugye múltkor is odaadtuk neki. Igen, Nevermind, 5000-et kellett volna, de mondjuk meg tudjuk azt csinálni, hogy most megint elmegyünk pénzt ö, kicsalni tőle, tehát ez, ez oké. Okay. Jó, tehát ez biztos. Oké, okay, Rufius. Jó, van nálunk Willow Bark, akkor azt se veszett el, akkor ezt is oda tudjuk neki adni. Illetve... Át kell irányítanunk a fickót, aki meg akarja ölni a... Tudjátok, aki a fürdőből jön. Na mindegy. Oké, okay, akkor ezt. Julia. Oh no. All right, I can do that. Poor guy. My uncle was a victim at rheumatism's altar, and he ended up killing himself. All right, got it. All right, let me see. Stop Fabia going in, but send the new arrival to the empty shrine. Understood. Oké. Okay. Na, és akkor ez kell. Jó, és akkor most el kéne mennünk kiváltani a két uh, rabot. Rabot. Két szolgát. Azt uh, a, a, az, az ellenzék jelöltjénél kell, ugye? Ha jó, de fura valami. Fura volt az irányítása valami, de az nem, az föl kell mennünk a, a toronyba, ugye? Mert itt a, ezért nem fog minket beengedni. Tehát itt nem tudunk csak úgy simán bemenni. Mert nem enged be.
Fú, nevermind, erre már nem is emlékszem. Még be tudunk itt jönni? Oké, okay. jó, jó, jó. Tehát meg kell várnunk, amíg uh, a József körbejár, és mindenkit uh, tehát teszi a dolgát, amit kértünk tőle most itt az elején. Csak nem vacakol a kontroller. Remélem nem. De a Suicide Pistához, tehát az az egyik, ott van egyébként a Tiberius, nem tudom látjátok-e. Nem Tiberius. Galérus, vagy hogy hívják, intézkedik. De tehát a, 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 aki le akar ugrani, azt kell az egyiket kiváltani. Tehát már ő az egyik, akit ki kell váltani, csak nem tudok beszélni. Tehát ő az egyik, akit ki kell váltani, a másik meg ugye Júlia, akit most mentünk meg már az életét. Nem? Tehát azzal tudom szerintem megventeni a, a leugrós embert, hogy, hogy kiváltom. Bár ezt még most nem tudjuk. Tehát vacakol valamit a kontrollerem. Nem, nem, a, nem a leugrósnak adom szerintem, hanem ennek itt, a, tehát a gazdájuknak. Gondolom. Ö, vagy hát megpróbálom neki adni, aztán meglátjuk. Gondolom akkor végez a József, amikor ráomlik a... Azt elvileg halljuk, mert azt mindig hallottuk eddig is, hogy ráomlik a szentély a fickóra. Igen, de én most odaadom a pénzt a fickónak, és egyből szaladok föl, hogy ne ugorjon le, mert ö, kiváltottuk. Tehát akkor tudjuk neki mondani, hogy don't jump, my friend, mert hogy minden rendben van. Vagy legalábbis, hát na, ez a terv. Aztán, hogy sikerül-e, azt majd meglátjuk, hogy, hogy hogy adja a sztori. Ha nem sikerül, akkor majd, majd igazítunk ö, valahogy. Amúgy nem tudom, miért akarom megmenteni. Majd, ó, mondjuk azon kívül, hogy, hogy nyilván ne halljon meg, de nem tudom, hogy a játék szempontjából ez bármit oszt szoroz. Na, fogjuk hallani, hogyha ráomlik. Elmegyek, megnézem. Addig csak nem ugrik le. Na hát, euh, akkor most már megpróbáljuk. Jó. Rómás József itt van, itt van a Áve, így van. She will guide you. Jó. Na mindegy, most megpróbáljuk akkor kiváltani őket. Na! What do you want? Hát akkor lehet, hogy mégse. Uh, are you 
insane? You barge into my villa uninvited and then make outrageous demands? Why would I withdraw from an election I'm bound to win? Don't talk nonsense. There's no such thing as the golden rule. How could you possibly know that? Nonsense! This is nonsense! I don't know how you know about my plans, but I'm absolutely sure Sentius is involved somehow. And now, I'm going to enjoy watching Demetrius kill him even more. Now, get out of here! You outstayed your very limited welcome. Mm. Jó, akkor uh, mégiscsak az lesz, hogy a, a Suicide-nek adjuk oda. Akkor irány fel. Uh, jó, felszaladunk gyorsan. Meg majd akkor adunk Júliának is egy ezrest. Octavia, welcome to life under the golden rule. It's a ghastly thing, is it not? How are you faring so far? All right, well, it was lovely to meet you. I look forward to getting to know you better. Or abuse. And if you ever... I can't believe this is how it ends. Oh no, 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 no. Orpheus, what are you doing? Get back from there. If you lose your balance, you'll fall. That's the idea. What? Why? Why would you want that? Why do you think I'm stuck for the rest of my life working for a man who treats me like an animal? I know, I know things are hard for you right now. They're hard for all of us. We're all in this together, Alpheus. Please, please just think this through. If you do this, it could be the sin that seals all of our fates. Is that what you want? I'm sorry, but I just don't care anymore. Please, Alpheus. Help him. If he goes through with it, it could be the end for us all. I don't know what to do. I've never had to deal with this sort of thing. Please, you need to talk to him. Thank you. And please, choose your words carefully. Okay. Let me guess. You're going to lecture me on how suicide is a crime against the Empire. Nem. Had de... Nem. De nem. Na jó, de oda akar nem adni. No, about that. How is that possible? Ja, jó, oké, oké. I never mentioned it to anyone. Well, if you say that, you don't understand. I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want it all to be over. It's too late for that. Julia and I made a pact. And she's already swallowed hemlock this morning. If I backed out now, I'd be betraying her. I can't do that. Okay, megmentett tük az életét. Tehát jó lesz. Really? That changes things a little. Igen. We're still in debt bondage to that monster. Nem is akar lehet, hogy most tudjuk mondani neki, hogy. Unless you happen to have two thousand denarii to pay off both of our debts. Éppen van. Really? Wait. So, I guess you'd want me to work for you then. <laughs> you'd do that for us. 
Meg von. Couple of complete strangers. Zhir. It seems today we are both blessed. This did not turn out how I thought. Thank you, friend. I never thought people like you existed. Okay. Thank you. I'll go and pay off our debts immediately. I just wish there was some way I could repay you. But I have nothing but the tunic on my back. At us now, Dida. I'll go and take care of things with Maliolus and tell Yulia the good news. Thanks again, friend. I'll never forget what you did for us. Igen, Shady Tadri, a az elején küldtük el Józsefet, hogy az igen, hogy tehát elküldtük Józsefet, hogy ő most nem kéne leugrani. Tehát ő mentette meg, mert volt nálunk szolfium, rezin, vagy micsoda. Jó, na és akkor az a kérdés, hogy most mit csináljunk. Mert ugye ettől még a választások ugye lesznek. Nézzük ezeket a lídeket. Jó, a systemben még nem voltunk. Oké. Okay. És Virgilt is nem, nem tudjuk még, hogy kizaklatja. Hát igen, valahogy le kéne róla beszélni, csak um, még nem tudom, hogy hogy. Valamivel meg kéne zsarolni, vagy ilyesmi. Látjátok, hogy a szép szóban nem hisz. Kéne valamilyen, um, tudjátok, az, ilyen szokásos, ilyen karaktergyilkosság kampányt indítani. Jó, hát itt még lehetne nyomozni. Meg meg, ja, igen. Oké, okay, és ez mi? Dig up some dirt, ott is írja. Így van. Szia, Kambli, jó estét! Állítsuk meg! Azt mondod? Hú, Kambli, igen! Nagyon egyhangú lett a dolog most. Mindig Kamilla tehát iszok este. Jó, mi van még itt? Ja, jó, hát esetleg most ezt, ha már itt van, akkor elmondhatjuk. Leugrunk akkor a hölgyhöz mondani, hogy van egy közös dolog, egy koi. A koin az közös dolog így mindenkibe. Equisia, how you want them? Fanshig. A new face, are they? And may Vesta watch over you. I'm Equitia. To what do I owe the pleasure of this visit? Because I'm hearing that. A, a, a leugrós József beszél Júliával, hogy minden oké. Okay. Oké. Okay. Sure right 
What have you noticed? Yes, I suppose that could be something. But then most of us do tend to carry coins on our person, don't we? What else? Yes, I understand many of our friends were carried here by a river current. What else? Szállva, uram, egy kis dénárod nincs, hogy értem. Buszégyre kéne. Hmm. There are definitely some common threads there. But I think we'll need at least a few. Még több kéne. Just seeing coincidences. Keep asking people how they wound up here. I don't want us to rush to any conclusions yet. De lassan már mindenkivel beszéltem. It weighs heavily on my mind. And dictates we should be sure. Yes. You should ask the others first. And did you notice anything? A pattern? That's true. I know I wasn't entirely sure how I wound up here. It's as I feared. I think I understand what poor Livia has been going through. Let me ask you this. Did you happen to encounter a stranger in the forest before you arrived here? And did you happen to catch her name? Karen. I see. And was this Karen by any chance wearing a hood? Because I've seen her before. There's something I think you should see. I think you'd better follow me to the baths. But don't follow too closely. We can't have people thinking we're bathing together. Húsz méter jó lesz. Vagy huszonhárom. És itt most... Na ez egy, amúgy egy remek feature. Ő irányítja, nem én. Tehát ez automatikusan követi a... Ezért. Ö, most Equisának a hangja volt nagyon halk valamiért. Szerintem azt elvakszolták egy kicsit. Ö, a többi eddig jó volt. De hogy szalad? Senkit nem láttam így fürdeni, rohanni. Tisztára, mint valami pesti fürdő. Na. All right, you're here. You were asking how I knew the young woman you met by the river was wearing a hood. Here, look down at the bottom of the baths. It's a little hard to make out in this light. If only we could see. Oh, what a marvelous lamp! But do you see it? Somebody waking up by a river in a forest to find a hooded figure with a coin. It's just as you described it. Only your pronunciation is a little off. The name you heard wasn't Karen. It was C H A R O N, as in Charon, the ferryman of the dead. Charon, who, in exchange for the right coin, helps the souls of the newly deceased cross the Styx, the river that separates the land of the living from the land of the dead. When I dragged you out of the river, I thought you were never going to wake up. I checked your pockets for ID, but all I found was some loose change. Hmm. Feels like I've spent my whole life in a dead-end job with an endless commute. Sorry if I sounded cagey, it's just that I don't always get the best reactions when I introduce myself. My name's Karen. There are a bunch of old stories about the gods punishing people by making them do the same futile task over and over. But on the bright side, at least you're not stuck in the underworld like they all were. I'm so sorry, my friend. Okay. I'm so, so sorry. I take it you know what this means. Oh. Tehát akkor ő az, aki átkísér a Styx folyón a más világra. Én Karen. I'm afraid so. It's all starting to make sense. All these people, 
whose last memory was running from the fires toward the river. It seems none of them escaped with their lives after all. Perhaps we should be grateful they don't remember their final moments. It also tells us that the Golden Rule is the work of Pluto, the god of the underworld, and why his epithet has always been father of riches. I know it's a lot to take in, and you look as if you have questions, so I'll try to answer them if I can. Okay, tehát a, a Golden Rule pedig Plutónak a műve, aki a túlvilágnak a istene. Vagy Underworld. Túlvilág. Túlvilág. Más világ. Nem. Na mindegy. Szóval, mi halottak vagyunk? That was my first thought too. In the old stories, the underworld was where the souls of the deceased were taken. But it was also possible for the living to reach it without dying, if they were particularly fearless. So I'm afraid I don't know. Fogalmas nincs, hogy halottak vagyunk, vagy nem. Oh, I'm sorry. I keep forgetting you're not from here. If you were Roman or even Greek, you would know these stories. Each of them is slightly different, whether the storyteller was Plato, Homer, Virgil, or Ovid. But they always involve the souls of the dead meeting a grim ferryman named Charon on the bank of a river. It was said that he'd help the new arrival cross only if they could pay him with a coin, an obol. That's why it was once our custom to bury our loved ones with a coin in their mouths. Charon's obol, we called it. Of course, an obol was a kind of Greek coin, because we inherited this knowledge from the Greeks. A révészbére. Ugye ez a... Csak ott nem a... Ugye a tróját, nem tudom láttátok-e a filmet. Ott a szemére tették, azt hiszem. Um... És azt, azt, azt hívták a, a révész bére. To be fair, the ferryman isn't exactly as the poets described. And he, she, they, they seem to appear to different people in different guises. You say you saw a young woman named Karen with a hood. And I once heard Kabash mention a stranger in a ram headdress named Kerti. And Rufius described meeting a stranger named Kamut Tabal wearing an eagle headdress. But whatever form this stranger took, they were always wearing a hood of some sort, and their name always began with a K sound. I suspect the only way you'll solve this riddle is if your paths cross again. Good question. Let's see. In the stories, Charon would always require a coin as payment for passage across the river. But that never made any sense to me. What does an ancient immortal being need with coins? <laughs> In our case, it seems Charon didn't take the coins we had. He or she merely checked we had one in our possession. So, maybe there's something special about the coins each of us had on us. And that might explain why we wound up here, but so many others did not. Then, maga se tudja, hogy mire kellett neki, tehát lehet, hogy csak uh, annyit akart, hogy van-e nálunk. Um, de never mind, lehet, hogy a kávégébe kellett. No, I mean, I had my suspicions, especially after Livia's ramblings. But I would never have figured it out without your help. I promise you. Now that we know where we are, we have to figure out what to do about it. If we don't want to be cast into gold for eternity. We don't have much to go on, except the old stories. I remember four in particular about heroes in the underworld. Hercules, the demigod and son of Jupiter. Orpheus, a Thracian poet. Sisyphus, a king of Ephyra and Aeneas, a Trojan hero. Hercules was able to leave the underworld because he cowed its god with his strength. Sisyphus and Orpheus both relied on their wits instead. They persuaded the goddess of the underworld, Proserpina, to help them escape. And finally, Aeneas was able to escape with the help of a spirit guide, who led him through a secret gate. So it seems you have two options. To confront the god of the underworld head-on, or find a way to escape 
with the help of Proserpina or some other guide. Mindkettő remekül hangzik. Hát... Hát de most miért köt bele, hogy... Hogy miért szólítottan elén? Na mindegy, megkérdezem ezt. This place is fairly well designed to keep us here. There's no way to climb up the shaft. And even if you could build a ladder big enough, just trying it would break the golden rule. We know that, thanks to the writings left behind by those who tried. Jó, tehát nem lehet megszökni. Legalábbis ő úgy, úgy gondolja. All Romans try to avoid saying it. And the reason is quite simple. He might hear us. You may refer to him as Pluto, if you wish, but you'll only be calling attention to yourself. Do so at your own peril. Mm, okay. Shh! Is everyone so blunt where you're from? Oh. That option would be the boldest, but also the only way to learn the truth about the Golden Rule, and maybe even put an end to it. As I said, Hercules managed to overpower the god of the underworld, but he was a demigod. Forgive my candor, but you are no Hercules. Are you telling me that you can? I won't pretend to understand exactly what that means, but if that's true, then perhaps you stand a chance. So, if you want to confront him, I'll help you as much as I can. Who knows? Perhaps your name will be uttered in the same sentence as Hercules one day. But first, you'd need an audience with you know who, and for that, you'll need to enter the great temple overlooking the city. The problem is, the door has been sealed shut for as long as I've lived here, and there doesn't even seem to be a keyhole. I suspect the answer lies in the desecrated obelisk in front of it. I'm not sure if you noticed, but there are four plaques missing from its base. It looks as though somebody, or a series of somebodies, forcibly removed them, and in doing so, dishonored and angered our divine keeper. Mm -hmm. If you could recover and replace all four of those missing plaques, I imagine he might be willing to receive an audience again. Okay. It's the towering stone monument, with four sides and a pyramid-shaped head, that stands before the great temple, a dedication to the god of this place. You'll find them all over Rome, but of course they were looted from Egypt many years ago. It seems one of them made its way here too, although how is a mystery. However, this one is unusual in that each of the four sides is decorated in a different style, Roman, Greek, Egyptian, and another I don't recognize. That means you'll need to recover four different plaques. Roman, Greek, Egyptian, and a fourth, a mystery plaque. Jó, tehát akkor az, hogy bemenjünk a templomba, és hogy beszéljünk Plutóval, ahhoz az kell, hogy valami szobrot rendbe tegyünk. És az kell négy alkatrész, hogy rendbe tegyük. Good question. To answer that, we first need to ask who would have defaced the obelisk in the first place. It would have had the god's name engraved into it. So it may be that whoever desecrated it wanted that name to be forgotten. And there's only one group of people I know of who might want to do that. There's a cult in Rome that often argued there is only one true god. Theirs, of course. They've been known to start fires as well as deface religious monuments whose existence challenged their beliefs. Again? If I were you, I'd go looking for them. Of course, they've all been in hiding since the fire last year, so finding them won't be easy. Quinticus. But I did yeah. hear a rumor they have a secret shrine somewhere in the city. Perhaps, if you could find that, you might be able to recover the Roman plaque. 
Ó, oh, tehát valami szik, titkos... Um... Szent helyük van ezeknek, vagy ilyen, igen, ahova járnak, gondolom, összegyűlni. Ö, igen, tehát ez a szekta, amelyik gyújtogatta, <gül> szekta a keresztények. Oké, okay. mi a görögökkel, vagy a göröggel? Perhaps Kabash, our Egyptian resident, will be able to tell us. Unfortunately, he disappeared weeks ago. But I did hear Aurelia is peddling rumors about him at the tavern. So, perhaps you could talk to her. Or just take a look in his room. I'm afraid you're on your own with that one. But perhaps finding the other three will illuminate the way. Oké, okay. és akkor ez volt a plútós kör, hogy, hogy uh, Plutóval beszélünk, vagy Voldemorttal ugye, mert hogy a nevét nem meri kimondani. Um, nézzük meg a alvilági istennőjét, hogy vele mit lehet tenni, mert hogy ugye um, mondta, hogy ő segített már megszökni korábban embereknek. As I mentioned, both Orpheus and Sisyphus were said to have persuaded Proserpina to help them escape. And Aeneas was guided to the exit. The problem is, those are the stories of a poet, a self-aggrandizing king, and a brawler about their own heroic deeds. So they should be taken with a grain of salt. First, Proserpina. What we do know about her is, well, it's a grim tale. It's said, the god of the underworld abducted and dragged her here against her will, forcing her into marriage. stories are true, then I suppose so. The problem is, how do we communicate with her without being noticed by her captor? Leaving that aside for a moment, there is also the possibility of a spirit guide. I don't suppose you've come across one of those in your travels? Hát valaki is ugdolózik, de akkor uh, ezek szerint ez a játékban is hallatszódik, nem csak én hallom. Truly? But you're only bringing this up now. Then again, I suppose you were worried I'd think you were as mad as Navia. Can you tell me more? Is it the same voice? What kinds of thing does it say? Fascinating. Perhaps she is a benevolent spirit. Or perhaps... Hmm... Perhaps you're hearing the voice of Proserpina herself. If she has indeed been abducted, it would make sense for her to speak in cryptic whispers to avoid detection. Tell me, has she told you anything that might lead you to the way out? No. I see. Well, let me know if you hear anything that might be a thread through this labyrinth. Okay. Akkor fürdünk, vagy nem? All right. I would suggest not discussing this with anyone. The best we can do for them is to let them remain oblivious for as long as possible. As for Livia, it seems she's been shouldering the weight of this terrible secret all this time. Perhaps it would comfort her to know she's not alone. Jó, tehát ez tök mindegy, mit választok. In any case, time is of the essence, so you'd best begin. May Fortuna guide you. Although you may not need her with Proserpina on your side. Hát én azért fürdök. Na jó, beszéljünk Lívjával akkor, először. Uh, Véd against the current. Okay.
Ó, oh, köszönöm Serit Adri az ötöst. Nagyon szépen köszönöm a támogatásod újfent. Uh, a Lívia hol van? Jól vagy? Citizen. Polgár. Itt még nem is voltunk. Ha. Érdekes. Na beszéljünk Líviával. Cerberus lifts his triple head and lets out his threefold graying. Livia, would you stop muttering like Medea over a cauldron? You'll scare away my customers. They follow their trades, imitating their previous lives, but they are ignorant. This again. You're in a world of your own, aren't you? Just as the ocean accepts the rivers of all the world, so this place accepts all the souls. But it does not notice the crowds that come. Vignapot polgárja, ja, az is jó. Ustito. Say it. Speak its name. Then it is true. I was right. I thought... I thought I saw it, but when the rest of them could not, I kept thinking I must have gone insane. I had to tell myself it was true over and over again, until I wasn't sure if I was deceiving myself. I must apologize if my words seem cryptic. I'd found comfort in reciting the metamorphoses by our great poet Ovid. He gives such an uncanny description of this place. I cannot help but wonder if he himself came here. Would you like to hear it? I will do my best to remember the relevant verse. There is a downward path, gloomy with fatal yew trees. It leads through dumb silence to the infernal regions. The sluggish Styx exhales vapor, and by that way, the shadows of the newly dead descend, entombed with full rites, and the ghosts of those, at last, given proper burial. The wide, thorny waste is cold and pallid, and the newly arrived shades are ignorant of the road that leads to the Stygian city where Black Dis has his cruel palace. As the ocean accepts the rivers of all the world, so this place accepts all the souls, and is never too small for any populace, nor notices the crowds that come. There the bloodless shadows wander without flesh or bone. Some crowd the forum, some the house of the ruler of the depths. Others follow their trades imitating their previous lives and still others incur punishment i hope i have done it justice and now we share a secret it's as if you've lifted a great burden from my shoulders thank you friend i think i should rest and me no matter you have given me hope May you follow in the footsteps of Hercules and return to the light of day. Hát nem akar beszélgetni. Veled mi a helyzet? Ah, oh, you're here. I'm so glad you decided to visit. I'm Aurelia, and uh, I hope I'm not being too forward, but. The moment I laid eyes on you, I was intrigued. There's a light in your eyes I've never seen before. A certain learning and sophistication.
I know you are a horrible person. Me, me at the nose. Uh, Aurelia. Ez a felesége Maci Lacinak. Maci Laci, az melyik? Fú, most nem, nem emlékszem már a karakterekre. Marcellus. Marcellus Valasz. Ja, Meliolus. Ő Meliolus felesége. Ó, ó, tudom, tudom, tudom. Vagy nem? Nem ő az. Mi a válasz? <gül> Jó, de nem, akkor nem az ő felesége. Jó, mindegy. I don't find you so intriguing anymore. Let's just forget that ever happened, so we can at least do business. So, what brings you to my tavern? Hmm. Okay. Yo, let the cabast. Not for a few weeks now. Last time I saw him, he was sitting at a table with Georgius, whispering about some job. Mm -hmm. I remember because they kept looking over their shoulders as if they didn't want anyone else to know. So uh, naturally, I hovered. Yeah, man. The one word I kept hearing was vanishing, and then the next day, Kabash just disappeared. Okay. Coincidence? I think not. Jó, a Gregorius-szal sugdolózott valamin. Ugye Gregorius meg azért lesz jó nekünk, mert ő meg tudja, hogy hol van a görög darabja az obelisknek. Ugh, let it go. Nothing's going to happen between us. You know, normally I'd expect you to buy me a drink before asking if I want to get out of here. Straight to business, huh? I can work with that. As a matter of fact, I do know a way out. I'm happy to tell you all about it, but this is valuable information we're talking about, and I don't just give it out like some cheap oracle. So, how badly do you want it? Is it worth, say, a thousand denarii to you? No. Már megint mehetünk. Simple. It's a one-way trip, and I'm not ready to go just yet. I like my life. Saint and Bluff, I'm with you. One day, maybe, but not now. I think of it this way. I have something of value, and I'm willing to share it for a price. That's not unethical. That's just good business. Now, do you want it or not? Ha! <laughs> it's hardly my fault if people misunderstand the terms of a deal. I mean, it does say, let the buyer beware, right outside my tavern. I just try not to think about it. Drink helps with that. As the saying goes, to drink is human. So we drink. Ennyi. Ennyire egyszerű. Na valami pletyi? Certainly. For ten dinari. Have you met Livia? She used to do my hair. Until one day she just... snapped. This place has that effect on people. Now she just stands around, caked in filth, muttering nonsense to herself. It's a real shame. Now I have to do my own hair. I hear that if Maliolus is elected, he's going to throw a small festival to celebrate, with entertainment and everything. Can't wait to find out what it is. 
Whatever you like. All right. See ya. Jó, lehet, hogy megyünk még egy kört majd, ha Netán úgy alakul a hölgyel, akkor vele már nem lehet beszélni. A prototype zipline. Jó, hát valaki szökni próbál, gondolom. Nem lopunk, minek? Majd jó, átbasszok megint a másik fickót. Ú, uh, ez a Veronai aréna. Nem, nem Veronába volt a, a Spartacus. Nem itt eszembe, hogy hol volt. De nem Veronába. Majd mindjárt írjátok, hogy hol játszódott. Nem, nem lopunk. Na, ide föl lehet jönni. Key to the chest in the shrine of Apollo. Ha. Oké. Pénzt nem lopunk, mert... Miért? Tehát majd húzunk ki a... Fizikóból még egy kicsit. Oké. Fish sauce. Oké. Nem. Household shrine. Apollo shrine. Oké. Jó. Erre más szerintem nincs. Oké. Kápua, azaz. Így van, kápua. Jó, menjünk tovább. Nem tudom, hol vagyok, de semmi gond. Ha. Oh, hello, Rainbow Warrior. Ja, ja, igen. Not from Livia. Graffiti. The blood less shadows wander without flesh or bone. Okay. Hmm. Hát Rainbow Warrior, megpróbáljuk. Um, guide nélkül. Bár stopsoros itt van guide-nak, ha valami nagyon nagy elakadás lenne. De nem, te tényleg megpróbál. Hogy tagú. Na 
nem akartam. Nem, nem. Hogy tudok legugolni? Így, oké, okay, megvan. Elfelejtettem már azóta. Aha. Nem tudom, hogy hol vagyunk most. Visszajutottunk ugyanoda. Erre jöttünk az előbb, ugye? Igen. Gyomosan kezd este lenni amúgy. Ó, oh. és itt vagyunk, a, ahol a választás lesz. Itt se sok minden van. Oh. Salve again, friend. Salve. I went and did as you asked, and it worked. How is it possible that you've just arrived here and you already know everyone and exactly what's about to happen to them? Ah. Uh. <laughs> Good one. But seriously, how did you know? Uh, you're toying with me, right? Wait, you're not kidding, are you? That's the only way you could have known. You're a bit like... Oh, what was his name? Sisyphus. Yeah, that's the one. Old King Sisyphus. Sisyphus was a Greek king a long time ago. For daring to think he could outsmart the gods, he was given a terrible punishment. He was forced to push a great boulder up to the top of a hill. Only, just as it reached the top, it would roll all the way back down to the bottom. Forcing him to start over and over and over again. Just like you. 
Actually, now that I think about it, there are a bunch of old stories about the gods punishing people by making them do the same futile task over and over. Tantalus was made to grasp at fruit on a tree he could never quite reach. The Pelides had to keep fetching water in a sieve. Oh, and Ixion was strapped to a wheel going round and round forever. But on the bright side, at least you're not stuck in the underworld like they all were. Anyway, I don't know which god you managed to upset to get yourself into this position, friend, but you seem all right to me. So, I'll tell you what. I'll keep doing whatever I can to help you. And you just focus on finding a way to break the cycle you're in. Anytime, you friend. Now, I'm going to keep your secret. Although, it's not as if I'll remember this next time we talk anyway, right? <laughs> oh, and if our conversations ever start to annoy you, just tell me you're busy. I know when I'm not wanted. May fortune smile on you, friend. Uh, jó. Uh, vissza kéne jutni valahogy a városba. <laughs> Itt is vagyunk. Um, Wonder how much one of these statues is worth on the outside. Nagyon anyagias valaki. Uh, na, mit kellene csinálnunk? Oké, okay, tehát figyelnünk kéne a, a suttogást. Oké. Okay. Nem. Ezzel kellene valamit kezdenünk. A különböző... Dézius-t? Várjál, az melyik volt? Dézius. Már nem is emlékszem. Jó, hogy őt gyanúsítjuk. Hát de nem Melérius? Ja, lehúzni. Jó, 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 oké, oké. Jó, bocsánat. El, félreolvastam a izét. Itt mentem mellettem amúgy. Hol van? Menj már szavazni, mi? Te, József. Gyorsan még tényleg le kéne húzni, mert... Lassan vége a napnak. Take your word for it, but perhaps you'd be interested in selling it to me. I mean, it's not as if you have any use for it down here. Now you're talking. I'm interested. How about a hundred denarii? Is my god it cat on my Oh, that's a little excessive, don't you think? It's not the bow of Ulysses we're talking about. All right, all right. But I'm going to need you to tell me before I pay up. Wait, wait, wait. Let's not be too hasty, friend. I just want a little assurance that I can trust you, that's all. Hmm, I suppose you're right. All right, you drive a hard bargain, but here's your money. Now, easy money. Uh, what? But I already knew that, you imbecile. Everyone knows that. I can't take that golden bow because stealing from the goddess in her own shrine would break the golden rule. You promised to tell me where I could get one of my own. What is this? Some kind of joke? I... I don't believe this is happening. Don't even talk to me. Na, mindegy pénzünk már van, nem mintha most uh, szerintem, hát lehet hogy, fog, lehet, hogy kelleni fog majd, bár nem hiszem. Nézzük már meg ezt a, uh, igen, unokázós csalás, azaz. Ó, oh, közben Sherry köszönöm a százast. Köszi szépen ismét. Um, A Rainbow Warrior azért köcsögösködtem ezzel az emberrel, mert ő is az volt, mit akartam. Ezt a román plakkot. Hmm. 
Jó, kérdezősködnünk kéne. Rufius, Marcellus, meg Octavia. Rufius hol is van? Én nem tudom, track. Na mindegy. Sometimes I stare at the great temple on the bluff, and I think, whatever is in there, it has to be important. Ő a végnapot? Akkor hát itt kéne állni, hát csak az a baj, hogy már nagyon este van. És ez csak délután áll itt. Hát mindegy, meg kellünk kérdezni mást, amúgy. Igazából. Marcellus, Octavia, Octavia fönt van. Vajon még? Lehet, hogy ő már nincs fönt. Hát, mert Marcellus sincs itt. Na hát, akkor ott a választásoknál, vagy ahol szavaznak, ott lesz. Mert elvileg oda megy mindenki most. Hát, ott el tudjuk őket kapni. Fortune, smile on you, sister. Check me, Chilla, and I keep. Isn't the great temple majestic? Hello. Have we met before? My name's Dooley. Dooley. I live here now because I got in trouble, and they they said they had to lock me up. I don't know. I don't remember things so good. I think it's just because I was looking for treasure. Yes. But I wasn't. I was just looking. They said I did it more than once. But I can't remember things so good. Then they called me mean names. They called. They called me a liar, Billy. Um. Yes. They said I have to live here now, and gave me this letter. But I'm not good with words. Do you? Do you think you could read it for me? Sanchez to Dulius. Tehát valamilyen elveszett treasure keres a fickó, és emiatt ír neki Sanchez. Mert hogy olyan fura viselkedése van. Vagy furán viselkedik. És akkor mondja, hogy ez a kincs nem létezik, és valószínű rosszul emlékszik rá. Egyfolytább ott a csatornák körül mászkált, ezért um, inkább becsukják, ne úgy megsértse a Golden rule -t. My friend Hannibal used to look after me. He said he always would. But then he died. 
It was very sad. He said, if anything ever happened to him, I had to find something very precious hidden away. He gave me this key and made me promise to keep it safe until I found the treasure. But I couldn't find it. Salve. All I remember is he said something about assistance. But when I went up to the high one, they put me in here. Now mm -hmm. nobody looks after me. Except my friend Galerius. And Ek. Ek. The priestess lady. Ek in Swatcha. She's a nice lady. Hannibal s s said I sh shouldn't give it to anyone I didn't trust. But maybe you could help me get out of here. Then I, I would trust you a lot. Mm. Galerius already tried that. He said the magistrate wouldn't listen. No matter what. Yeah, yeah, igen. Uh, majd én megkeresem azt a kincset, hát ha megtalálom neked. What about the rules? I don't want everyone to get in trouble because I was bad. Like Galerius. He's nice. I like Galerius. He made me a doll. And everything. If you help make him magistrate, he can get me out of here, and I can give you the key to my treasure. <laughs> Hannibal said it was in the cisterns. I can't remember what it was, just that it was way up high and very precious. Oh, I'm going to Huh. Ez mi? Nem én tettem. Nem én voltam. Oké. Okay. Na nézzük, hogy itt vannak-e már az emberek. Nem. Nincsenek itt. Na föl lehet mászni, csak nem tudom, hogy minek. Nézzük meg. Oh, no. Bees. She not let look manly. Oh. Hát végül is le. Jó, oké. Okay. Nézzük a feladatot. Oké, okay. de hol van mindenki? Na mindegy, öm... hol a kulcs? Na jó, de ezt most nem fogom látni, ugye? Mert még nem jutottunk el oda, hogy tudjuk, hogy hol van a... És nem, nem tudunk senkivel beszélni, mert mindenki eltűnt, de hova tűntek? from a faraway land. Greetings. I'm Georgius. It gladdens me to see another foreigner in our midst. We must stick together, you and I. My friend, your words intrigue me more and more. But yes, very well. Ask me what you will. Ah, 
I knew this day would come. I do not wish to lie to you, my friend, but even discussing this matter is dangerous. Please, let us live the live coals safely beneath the ash. Very well, but the magistrate would not look kindly upon us. It's not your nice word. Keep it to yourself. For several months now, I have been sneaking out at night to worship the gods of my ancestors in the temple of Demeter. Each day, I leave offerings of food in the hope that we may have a bountiful harvest. And yet the next day, when I return, the food is missing. So I ask, who or what is devouring the food in this temple? Stranger still. Once I sat in front of my shop like the hundred-eyed Argus until dawn to see if I could spot a thief going in. But do you know what I saw? Nothing! Nobody entered. And yet when I went to take a look, my offering was gone. It is bizarre, is it not? When I told my friend Kabash of this at the tavern, he offered to help investigate. He went in, and to my dismay, he was never seen again. Mm. It is the only Greek temple in the city. Head towards the baths, and it is the last building on your right. Okay. Glad. És akkor a Greek plekket még megkérdezzük. And in a city full of Romans you are asking me, because I am Greek, let me tell you something about Greeks and Romans. My name is Georgios, yes, but the Romans, they do not care. They hear me say Georgios and they think, ah, he must mean Georgius. Good Roman name. They do this all the time. They see us worshipping Zeus, they copy us, but call him Jupiter. They take Hades and call him Pluto, Persephone, Proserpina. I am flattered that they copy our ideas, but why must they change the names? Do they want credit for making it all up? Do they want to forget where it came from? At first, I pull my hair out. After a while, I give up, and I become Georgius the Roman. I accept the world is Roman. Plus, I have no hair left to pull. But my point is this. If you want to know who stole an old Greek name, look no further than the sticky-fingered Romans. The plague you seek was pilfered from a collection of old Greek relics by none other than Dooley. Uh, he cannot help it. Like a typical Roman, he likes shiny things, especially those that once belonged to my people. And besides, it makes him happy. So I say, let him keep it. I believe he still has it with him, in his cell, just opposite the temple of Dooley. I hope that our paths cross again soon, my Ha. Megkérdezzük akkor. Hello? Hello? Have we met before? Na, ennek minden 10 perc egy új nap. Do you like it? It's shiny, isn't it? It makes me happy just looking at it. But if I gave it to you, then I wouldn't have it anymore, and I'd be sad. Not even sure now. Um, well, if you get me out of here, then I wouldn't need it anymore because I'd already be happy. Then you could have it, and you'd be happy too. Galerius already tried that. He said the magistrate wouldn't listen, no matter what. Mm -hmm. Like Galerius. That had to rank all got no. Nice. I like Galerius. He made me a doll and everything. I don't think he likes me. Yeah, Galerius will let me out. Then you can have my plaque, and everyone will be happy. Hmm. Bye bye. De akkor a Galerius is indul a választáson. Nem csak a Melilus, meg a Sanctus, vagy ki. 
Na mindegy. Akkor uh, hol az a... Itt a fürdő. De miért jöttem ide? Itt van a templom, ugye? Ez a görög templom. Igen. Jó, de itt meg nincs semmi. Bázák, azok vannak. Sokféle. Um, jó, itt nincs semmi. Igen, bárkire kivéve uh, őkre. Hát mondjuk ezt még meg tudjuk csinálni. Mert ugye a... Tehát a Greek Black akkor Dulinál van. Csak valahogy el kell, meg kell tőle szereznünk, mondjuk hogy engedjék el. Na mindegy, megpróbáljuk Malilust ö, megzsarolni, hogy... Ne induljon el a választásokon. Föltesszük a kérdést, hogy ő Quintikus-e. Amúgy is meg akartam tőle kérdezni. Hello? Get out of my villa before I have Demetrius throw you out. Jó van, ne hisztisz már. Now you've crossed a line. Get out of there. Hát, ha nem, hát nem. Akkor beszélünk. Esetleg Szenzsösszel. Citizen. We're finally alone. I assume you already know who I am. May I know your name? We have? Wait. If I understand correctly, someone is about to break the golden rule, forcing me to create a portal in time to bring you here? I must have entrusted you with figuring out who the culprit <laughs> is. Only, I assume we failed. And you had to start over. Is that about right? If so, what happened? Ah, I see. Look, it's unfortunate. But all that matters now is that you make use of what you've learned and gathered and do better next time. Ejection. Now, I assume you sought me out again for a reason. Engedendulit. You mean Julius? Releasing him is out of the question, I'm afraid. That man is a liability we simply cannot afford. Perhaps you're not aware he was caught multiple times sneaking around in places he should not have been. Look, I can see where you're going with this. You think me cruel. I assure you, that is not the case. You may not be aware of this, but it was not so long ago, during the Republic, the law of the Twelve Tables would have required that he be killed as soon as he was born, owing to his deformities. Here, we see to it that he has food, water, and shelter, and, most importantly, he is able to continue living. A privilege that would be taken away from all of us, were he to be released and commit the crime of trespass. The man has no self-discipline, <coughs> or comprehension of what is going on around him, and is an incorrigible rule-breaker. <coughs> I will not jeopardize the lives of my people so that one man can go free. 
Was there something else? Jó, tehát nem fogja elengedni. Hát, az, hogy ki fogja a Golden Rule-t megszegni. Hát... If you stopped one person from breaking it and you're still here, then there must be someone else about to break it. Still. Ah, Allow okay. me to explain. Mm, jó, When you discovered the ritual to Proserpina, the instructions came with a warning about paradoxes. The crux of it is this. If you do anything to change the course of history <coughs> in such a way that your very being here is impossible, you will have created a paradox. To illustrate. When the golden rule is broken, I will open the doorway that will bring you here to prevent it from being broken. If you manage to succeed in saving our lives, then I will have no reason to open the doorway, and you will never have come here. A paradox. You see? The same thing would happen if you, say, inadvertently, allowed me to die. If I can't summon you, then you can't be here. Obviously. If either of those things were to happen, I am given to understand you would be flung back to your original time, having changed the course of history for us and yourself. So the fact that you are still here means someone is going to break the golden rule, and there is yet work to do. Understand? Excellent. So it looks like you'll have to continue your investigation. Now, was there anything else you wanted to ask? Hát never mind, de akkor akkor vissza megyek megint az elejére és szenszes megint él. De akkor nem tudja kinyitni a hát igen. Lehet, hogy akkor az a megoldás. Én nyilván nem a legjobb maradjunk annyiba. És ez. Ask them. Jó, ezeket már meg. Kérdeztük korábban, Now, igen. Was there something else you wanted to discuss? Sextus Sentius Imperiosus is my name, though magistrate is the proper way to address me. Before I wound up here, I was a decurion in the cavalry of Imperial Rome, helping protect civilization from the barbarians. It's a cavalry officer. I had 30 men under my command. This was my uniform. As magistrate, I usually wear a toga. But today, I may need to survive long enough to create the portal for you. So, it seemed prudent. Akkor ő minden egyes alkalom, amikor triggel elődik a vég, akkor megnyitja a portált. My men and I were at the Emporium in Rome as honor guard for a visiting dignitary arriving upriver by barge. Now the port is usually bustling, but just as our guests arrived, waves of people began running toward the river from streets and alleyways in every direction. They were trying to escape a terrible fire. The crowd sent my horse into a panic, and I remember it losing its footing by the water's edge. The next thing I knew, I was waking up on a riverbank not far from here in the company of some stranger. I went looking for my horse and discovered that lonely temple. You can probably figure out the rest. I was elected seven months ago, uncontested because of my command experience. Since then, there's been growing agitation for another election. They're supposed to be annual, but I agreed to hold it sooner, hoping it would placate my constituents. Unfortunately, it just seems to have emboldened certain elements instead. Very well. If I did, I'd have led these people out of here already. Mm. Okay, that you didn't do the deal out of it. I've had plenty of time to think about it. Let me see if I can sum up my thoughts. I've always considered my guiding star to be the well-being of the Roman people. Our survival and prosperity have always hinged upon honoring the peace of the gods, the sacred accord between the gods and the people of Rome. Give the gods what they want and we all prosper. Dishonor them and we all die. It's as simple as that. 
The real enemy in this place is not the golden rule, but human failings. The temptation to slide into degeneracy, greed, and hubris. Degeneracy. I trust that answers your question. Ez ma már nem lenne PC. Thank you. I'll be waiting here for news. Uh, okay. Na, mindig legalább vele is beszéltünk. Um, de hogy miért nem tudunk most beszélni a marcellus azt nem tudom. Na mindegy. Uh, lehet azért, mert már késő este van. Vagy hát este ledik, inkább úgy mondanám. Na, mit tudunk még csinálni? Ezt most biztos nem, mert nem, nem engedte. Hmm. Ja, lehet egy sneakers kéne neki. Mondjuk igaz, valóban beszóltam neki, ez kétségtelen. Mert mondtam neki, hogy mondjon le. És ez nem tetszett neki. Na, kezdjük előről. Jó, hát ez a fő feladat, oké. Okay. Jó, hát itt elmondhatjuk, hogy kit gyanúsítunk, de szerintem ez még most korai. Jó, ez mindenképp kellene csinálnunk. Jó, hát ez halljuk szerintem menet közben majd. Ezt is meg kéne majd kezdenünk lassan. Hát virgil nem tudom, hát esetleg ezt még megnéz, megnézzük akkor ilyen, ez mint lead. De itt nem is tudom, hogy hát nézzük meg a akkor ezt. Tehát, hogy ki az, aki zaklathatja virgil -t. Pénze. Van fish sauce. Most itt átkutatjuk a lakásukat, hogy találunk-e valamit. Ancient Rom Cavalry Helmet. Oké. Okay. Nagyon szereti ezt a fermentát. A szószt. Jó, hát itt más nem látok. Galerius? Horatius? Looking a bit troubled there. Still no sign of Centilla. And I haven't slept right three weeks. Don't be too hard on yourself. From what I hear, nobody saw it coming. Anyway, I thought you Stoics weren't supposed to worry about things you can't control. Yeah, but I keep thinking. What if there is something I can do? What if she's out there somewhere, suffering, waiting to be found? Sounds like you're torturing yourself. Leave that for the gods. Try to relax, get some rest. Tomorrow's a new day. I suppose you're right. Kihallgattuk őket, nem, nem sok minden derült ki. Igen, ez egy, ez egy beszólás alapvetően. Megjegyeztük. Só helyet használták a hal szózt. Értem. Jó, itt is voltunk amúgy. Domishesnek volt egy gladiátor pajzsa. Oké. Okay. Nem lopunk. Jó, hát itt nincs semmi. Akkor még... Föl 
Minecraftról jövünk ide is megnézni, de itt is, mintha lettünk. Oh. Tehát akkor Rufius volt. Jó, uh, már csak meg kéne találnunk Rufius-t. Hova megy Rufius? Election Rufius? Tudjuk, hogy Rufius a, aki zaklatja um, Virgil-t. Ugye Virgil-nek hívják. Virgil, igen. Citizens, we have a quarate body of voters gathered here to elect the city's magistrate. The candidates are Sextus Sentius Imperiosus and Marcus Maliolus Gerges. As agreed, we shall dispense with ballots, and candidates will abstain from voting. Let's make this quick. As I say your name, call your vote. I'll start with you, Horatius. Sentius, of course. Georgius. Sentius. Dacius. Maliolus. Galerius. If I abstain, I'm just here to observe. Virgil. Maliolus. Ulpius. Sentius. Rufius. Maliolus. And finally, Domitius? Maliolus. Who else? Citizens, you have made your decision. Your new magistrate is Marcus Maliolus Gurgis. In the location. Hail Magistrate Maliolus. Matter what? Hail Magistrate Maliolus. That's more like. Már csak, mert gondolom... Nem erre volt, merre volt. Uh, erre elvileg visszatalálok, ugye? Gondolom. Vagy nem, merre volt? Mert valahogy itt tényleg a, a szavazást kellene. Megyek össze-vissza. Na, erre visszajöttem ide. Treacherous leader to instill fear in all of us. This is why he's in his gladiator gear. They've been planning this all along. Shut up, all of you. The magistrate has spoken. I'm going to enjoy killing you, old man. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one.
Let it go, Lovis. Shit. Az a baj, nagyon kevés a háping. Ah, mondjuk annyira nem kevés. Cikszak van. Nagyon fontos. Cikszakban. Hát kezdjük előről. Stop soros, köszönöm szépen a százast, és neked is edit Adri. Köszönöm, köszönöm. Szevasz. Salve, friend. Mind telling me who you are and what you're doing with that bow on your back? Oh, you sound serious. I'm listening. Julia. Oh no. All right, I can do that. Oh, poor guy. My uncle was a victim at rheumatism's altar, and he ended up killing himself. All right, got it. All right, let me see. Stop Fabia going in, but send the new arrival to the empty shrine. Understood. Okay, és akkor már Ulpiusnak is oda tudjuk adni a pénzt. But how did you? All right, of course. I'll make sure this gets to him. I'll go. But once I'm done, I'll need you to tell me how you know all of this. Okay, ez amúgy azért hasznos, mert ez ilyen, ilyen, mely mely leegyszerűsítő nem nekünk kell megcsinálni. Uh, Oké, okay. na akkor uh, hol van a The Sinner? Oké, okay, tehát akkor ezt most biztos megcsináljuk, beszélünk Rufius-szal, hogy mondjuk miután adtunk neki uh, a reumájára gyógyszert, Hagyja abba a Virgil baszogatását. Már bocsánat. He watches through their eyes. Öff. Oh. Oké, okay, hát akkor ezt most nem tudjuk. Jó, esetleg megkérdezzük Maliolust, hogy ő Quinticus-e. És itt Adi most csak ezt írja ki, most úgy állítottam be. Meg kell várnunk, amíg Galius végzik végez a körrel. Mondjuk a, előtte még a román plekről megkérdezzük. <gül> Sedi Tadri, köszönöm az újabb százast. Köszi. Um, jó, az a Golden Rule parancs, nincs az a gond.
hogy hitetlenek vagyunk? Hát, alapvetően én mindig is az voltam. Na, lehetek hozok te, mert elfogyott. Kiderült a szörnyű igazság? Ő... Rufius, oké. Okay. Na, mindjárt beszélünk rufius is, csak előbb akkor... Nem, még mindig nem. Még a végén kiderül meliolus is, hogy görög. Demetrius doesn't usually let anyone in here without a hefty tribute, so you must have been desperate to see me. Well, what do you want? Look, if I had a Roman plaque in my possession, I'd be happy to sell it to you, but I don't, so I can't. Jó, te nem tudja. My name is Marcus Maliolus Gurgis. You seem to have confused me with someone else. You... you mean my heterochromia? I am guilty of nothing more than having different colored eyes. And I'm hardly the only person with the condition. Alexander the Great had it too, as it happens. I like to think it is simply the way the gods have chosen to mark a natural-born ruler. Nothing more. Well, I am not suffering from any delusions, as today's election will firmly establish. Unlikely, because it simply isn't true. Now, was there something else you wanted? I'm afraid not. Jó, tehát akkor nem ő... Vagy nem tudja, hogy hol van az a római uh, alkatrésze a szobornak, az obelisznek. Um, és tagadja, hogy ő Quinticus, pedig ő az. Szóval, hogy keresünk bizonyítékot. Hát, nem tudom, hogy itt találnánk-e bizonyítékot erre. Hm. Nem hiszem egyébként. Született volna azon? Így van. A ruler. De ezt már körbejártuk, ezt a kulipintyót, és itt nem találtunk semmit. Szerintem, ami terhelő lenne ránézve. Oké, okay, Note from Julia. Ezt már megnéztük. Ugye ez Juliának a, a szobája. Itt mérgezte meg magát. Ez Ulpius szobája. Ezt is megnéztük, Ulpius is el volt keseredve, de most már ő is rendben van. Egy nagy váza. Remek, már akkor is ütött kopottak voltak a vázák. Oké. Okay. Igen, és top soros a, a stream címébe is utaltam, hogy igyekszek haladni, de de men is el suffer. Jó, és erre se volt semmi. Ide nem tudtunk bejönni. I'm not supposed to be in here. Claudia. 
Chiesa Claudia. Talk. What business could you possibly have with me? My marital affairs are no concern of yours. Thank you very much. Oh, miért vagy bezárva? A semmi közöd a családi ügyeimhez. Hmm, an intriguing proposition. Go on. Igen, felesége. Hmm, perhaps you're not as silly as those clothes make you look. Felesége. What makes you say that? You know, I may have the very thing you're looking for. Some time ago, when he still cared for me, he wrote me a love letter. Only he used the wrong name. Now, a man's wife by the wrong name is not unheard of among philandering Romans. But in this case, the name he got wrong was his own. I confronted him about it. And he stammered through some incoherent response. I let it go eventually, and yet questions have lingered in the back of my mind ever since. But wait a minute. Why exactly are you helping me? He had some kind of new card. I couldn't agree more. One hand washes the other, as they say. It seems our interests are aligned. I imagine knowing his true identity will give me the leverage I need to manage him appropriately. But first, I need you to do something for me. Hogy ne? Legyen valami nagyon bonyolult dolog létszíves. I want you to bring me some wine. Just one small urn should do it. Oh, don't look at me like that. I know this must be hard for you to wrap your sweet little pleb head around. So what do you need me to spell out? Hát azt gondolom a kocsmából tudunk hozni. Let me tell you something about Maliolus. He talks a lot about freedom, but what he doesn't tell you is that he means freedom for men. After all I've done for him, counseling him through his entire election campaign, and he had the audacity to lock me in here. Hmm. He said it was for my own good, and that my drinking was unbecoming of a lady, let alone the wife of a magistrate. I'll show him unbecoming tonight. Yeah, party. I'm going to get good and merry, and if he tries to discipline me again. I'll threaten to expose his true identity in front of everyone. I am so looking forward to it. Okay, tiny got tiny to come with I told. If we double king Eric. So you'll help me. Excellent. Now you'll need to pay a visit to that strumpet Aurelia in her tavern. I expect you'll have to flatter her a bit. If that doesn't work, you might be able to get some advice from Yulia, who's probably still at the shrine of Apollo. I heard they used to be close. They both appreciate the poetry of Sappho of Lesbos. If you get my meaning. If you know what I mean. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, we mean I'm going to be Ares, Greek god of war. Okay, Minerva. Me one. Okay, na mehetünk. Hozzunk bort, meg beszélünk Rufiusszal. Ha megtaláljuk Rufiuszt. Boy. 
She will guide you. Isn't the great temple majestic? Check to name it key. Savas. Name's Rufius. Better watch your step. Uh huh. No idea what you're talking about. What? That was Galerius, not you. Oh. He got that from you? I guess you did help me then. Huh. I think I have seen that plaque. Sorry I lied. Can't be too careful these days. Head into the caves behind the theater. Turn right, then right again. Oh. And here. You'll need this key. Okay, tehát akkor lehet, hogy mindjárt megvan a román, római rész. You didn't get that from me. Be kell mennünk a ballangba, aztán jobbra és jobbra. No idea what you're talking about. Ah, look, I, I haven't been at my best lately. I know that. It's the rheumatism. It starts with constant pain in all your joints. Then the pain starts to mess with your head. Makes you angry. Mean. I know that's not an excuse for how I acted. But it's the truth. But with the willow bark, I'm already starting to feel like myself again. I'll leave him alone from now on. It's not as if I was ever going to hurt him anyway. I was just lashing out. I'm going to go and clean up the graffiti. Just forget this ever happened. Will you? Okay. Na, ez is megvan, akkor gyorsan beszélünk már, ha itt vagyunk. Virgil el, hogy minden rendben lesz. Ah, a new face. Salve, and welcome to a little community. My name's impossible to pronounce for most people, so you can just call me Virgil. I hear we have you to thank for saving Julia's life. I'm glad you arrived when you did. Ah, uh, what demon or spirit told you about that? You went snooping in his place? That was risky. We're lucky you didn't cross any lines. Have you spoken to him about it? Really? How did you manage that? Ah, uh, poor fellow. I've heard that can really mess with a person's head. Well done for figuring that out. Really? That's promising. I'll keep an eye out for him. Na, jó, ezt is megoldottuk. Um, szuper. Uh, menjünk tovább a kocsmába. I need your help. Várjatok, innen átjutunk a kocsmába? Mindig eltévedek. Menjünk inkább emelre, mert... Nem akarok ott bolyongani a barlangnál, bár oda is be kéne menni. Hú, stopsoros, amúgy igazad van. Az SPQL sokkal jobb, mint a GDPR. Ez, ez biztos. Hát, kéne beszélnünk Júliával előtte? Hol van ez a... Ez a quest? Nem kell, nem kell, megoldjuk, megoldjuk. Cerberus lifts his triple head and lets out his threefold braying. Livia, would you stop muttering like Madeira over a cauldron? You'll scare away my customers. They follow their trades, imitating their previous lives, but they are ignorant. This again. You're in a world of your own, aren't you? Ah, oh, you're here. 
I'm so glad you decided to visit. I'm Aurelia, and uh, I hope I'm not being too forward, but the moment I laid eyes on you, I was intrigued. There's a light in your eyes I've never seen before. A certain learning and sophistication. What was that? Some kind of joke? If it was, it wasn't funny. <sighs> I take back what I said. Suddenly, I don't find you so intriguing anymore. Let's just forget that ever happened, so we can at least do business. So, what brings you to my tavern? I do, but I'm afraid it's not for sale. It's the last jug in the entire city, so I'm saving it for a... A uh, romantic occasion. Hát, ez szerintem nem fog működni most. Úgyhogy akkor megpróbáljuk ezt. Everything except this. Sorry, sweetheart. Really? That's your move. Honey, I'll admit I was intrigued by you at first, but then you had to go and open your mouth. Unfortunately for you, nobody gets a second chance at a first impression. What's that supposed to be? The riddle of the Sphinx? Ask Julia, okay. Alright, see ya. Um... Nem tudom, hogy ezt most ebbe az iterációban meg tudjuk-e még csinálni. Könnyen lehet, hogy nem. De mindegy, azért elugrunk Júliához, hát ha mond valami okosat. Ez egyre jobb. De Júlia mit keres ott fönt? Ja, nem akar a földön járni, így van. Hello? Be careful who you trust. Sorry, I'm still a bit out of it. Galerius just saved my life. Az nem ő volt, hanem én. Lucretia says I'm supposed to rest. Really? You're going to give that snake a taste of her own medicine? I'm in. What do you need? Ah, so you need to sweep her off her feet then? Is that it? I think I can help you with that. No. As much as it disgusts me to say this, we were sort of involved before she betrayed me. So. I know her better than anyone. The thing you need to know about her is this. She's obsessed with money. An ostentatious display of wealth probably wouldn't hurt. One more thing, and I feel dirty saying this. She keeps a journal upstairs in her room, beside her bed. If you could somehow take a look, that might tell you how she thinks. Okay. May Nemesis guide you. No. Megvan, I did hear from Ulpius that she disappeared. It's very sad. She was such a lovely young woman. But I'd been locked in Maliolus's villa for months before she went missing, so I can't help you, I'm afraid. Yo. All right. Okay. Goodbye. Na, szerzünk egy kis pénzt, meg megnézzük azt a uh, naplót. Mert um, abba lehet info. Most nem is tudom, hogy mennyi pénz van nám, de mindegy, tudjátok a pénz milyen. Ha van lehetőség, akkor, 
akkor kell szerezni egy kicsit. Hol van? Ah, itt van. Hello! How you do? És te hogy vagy? Hello there, friend! May I say, that is a glorious bow you're carrying. Do you mind if I ask where you acquired it? Well, I'll take your word for it. But perhaps you'd be interested in selling it to me. I mean, it's not as if you have any use for it down here. Now you're talking, I'm interested. How about a hundred denarii? Oh, that's a little excessive, don't you think? It's not the bow of Ulysses we're talking about. All right, all right. But I'm going to need you to tell me before I pay up. Wait, wait, wait. Let's not be too hasty, friend. I just want a little assurance that I can trust you, that's all. Hmm, I suppose you're right. All right, you drive a hard bargain, but here's your money. Now, the location of that bow. Uh, what? But I already knew that, you imbecile. Everyone knows that. I can't take that golden bow because stealing from the goddess in her own shrine would break the golden rule. You promised to tell me where I could get one of my own. What is this? Some kind of joke? I... I don't believe this is happening. Don't even talk to me. Okay, pins one. I'll come with you. I'm going to look De azt nem biztos, hogy hát mindegy, elmegyünk arra, és hát lehet, hogy ott lakik valahol a, a kocsma környékén. És akkor hát, ha ott megtaláljuk. Don't believe a word they tell you. Is it Galerius? No, ka. Kulipinjoya. Horatius. Hát, nem biztos, hogy megtaláljuk. Ez meg fogalmam sincs, hogy ki. Oh. Kabas, tu kabas. Még ezt jó, hogy megtaláltuk. Kerti. Jó, hát nagyjából ezt mondta el a... A, a nő is egyébként, hogy, hogy Kabásnak is valami ilyesmi élménye volt, mint nekünk, ott a folyóból kihúzták ilyesmi. Oké, okay, akkor ez Kabásnak a szobája. Itt nem tudom, mi történt. De itt nincs semmi. Kerti törpe, igen. Ez meg uh, Rufiusnak a szobája, igen. Jó, akkor ezen az oldalon nincs. Uh, itt voltunk. Turns. Ez Virgil szobája, akkor gyerünk fel. Névia, Névia. Key to the chest of the shrine of Apollo. Okay. Ez teltesszük, mert ez majd kelleni fog. Liviának csak egy kis pénze van. Ez meg Lucréciáé. Hm. 
Ja, jó, tettem már egyszer, oké. Okay. Jó, jó, jó. Uh, akkor nem tudom, hol van. Igen, az, az a napló jó jönne. De nem fogjuk most hát. Nem. 49 melodies fetch again with incessant labor. The water they have lost. I love your clothes. So exotic. You stay away from my money. Is that you, Monta? I see them in the fall. Ez, na, itt vagyunk Auréliánál. Minerva szobor, itt is. Micsoda ablak. De hol a... Basz. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. Tettük a naplót. Na, gyerünk. Köszönöm szépen a százasokat, Stop Soros és Edith Adri. Um, the Man is a Na, de mindegy, a, elvileg az inventory itt van. Ebből meg már van kettő. Um, nem csak a kulcsot raktál. Na, hát akkor. Hello. Salve, friend. Mind telling me who you are and what you're doing with that bow on your back? Oh, sounds serious. I'm listening. Okay, so now this one is already done. Julia? Oh no. All right, I can do that. Poor Virgil. Poor Rufius too, I guess. All right, got it. All right, let me see. Stop Fabia going in, but send the new arrival to the empty shrine. Understood. But how did you... All right, of course. I'll make sure this gets to him. I'll go, but once I'm done, I'll need you to tell me how you know all of this. Jó, na és akkor... Pénzünk mennyi van? Hát ez soknak számít. Gondolom. Nem tudom, mi történik, ha kinyitjuk most a, a ládáját. I love your clothes. So exotic. Oké. Okay. 
Na, lássuk. Ó, hogy ő adta el a hemlokot Júliának. Egy ezresér. Az igen. És Ulpiusnak. De én ezt nem értem. Hát ha Júliának volt ezer dénárja, meg Ulpiusnak is volt ezer dénárja, akkor miért nem váltották ki magukat? Jó, ennyi. Jó, hát nem loptuk el, csak elolvastuk. Na. You stay away from my money. Oh, do us all a favor and drink hemlock, Capet murder. Oh, do us all a favor and drink hemlock, Capet murder. Nem nem tudunk más csinálni most. Hát mondjuk tudnánk, akkor megyünk még egy izét. Jó, hát ezt csináljuk most, ugye? Görög templomba kellene elmennünk. De ott nem, nem, nem ott voltunk. Na, elmegyünk a görög templomba, meg beszéljünk Oktáviával. Aztán utána... Aztán után eljövünk és agyon lőjük uh, Auréliát. Ó, oh, hogy ez az az út, ami levisz oda. Oké. Okay. Jó, lassan már csak kiismerem a mappot. Ja, várja, itt van a ró ró római, a román, a római, <gül> ugye, mint ahogy a filmben is volt, hogy egy régi román, vagy a római, igen, na mindegy. Oké, okay. jó, és ezt most ki tudjuk nyitni, és itt is van. Jó. És egy hal. De ez az előbb, előbb itt, itt már voltunk. Miért nem vettük föl? Na mindegy. 
Római, jaj, ja. Oké, okay, na. Menjünk tovább. És akkor most megyünk a görög templomba. Ami pedig itt lesz. Temple of Demeter. Itt sem nagyon találtunk semmit. Ezek határozottan görög vázák. Oké, okay, menjünk tovább. Nincs a barlang van itt lent. Come and join me by the fire. Hello. Hello. Welcome. May I ask your name? It's a sincere pleasure to meet you. Tell me, what brings you all the way down here? Kabash, I know this man. He came through here some weeks ago. I will tell you everything I know. At first, a request. I have been living down here alone for many years, with nobody to talk to but myself. Something I long for above all else before I die is a good philosophical argument with somebody astute. I'm hoping that person is you. Let us find out with this simple question. Have you deduced the name of the god responsible for the golden rule? Excellent. I see you are indeed quite astute. Very few come to that realization before their time in the sun is over. Now, will you join me in a friendly Socratic dialogue? Wonderful. Then let me begin with a question. Hey. Would you say you know the difference between right and wrong? Philosophizing. You are an overthinker too. We are the same then. Is probably why I became a philosopher. But if you struggle with right and wrong normally, then down here with the golden rule. Surely your struggle can only have become more difficult. Well, that's reassuring. And the truth is, you're not alone. You see, out there in the world, 
being uncertain about right and wrong was acceptable, because our mistakes rarely had consequences. So we would tell lies and bend rules and turn a blind eye and rationalize, and yet still find a way to think of ourselves as good people. But under the golden rule, morality matters. The slightest wrongdoing could result in a mass execution. So to navigate this maze, we would have to be certain about the difference between right and wrong. Wouldn't you agree? That is an excellent question, and it leads directly to my next line of inquiry. So let me ask you this. Is there one system of morality which is always perfectly correct, which you could follow in every situation and always do the right thing? Are you sure? Or is it possible that humans simply haven't figured out the right system yet? So is it up to each of us to decide what right and wrong mean to us individually? Or must we simply follow the laws and customs of whichever community we're in? Tehát, hogy individualisták vagyunk, vagy a közösség elveit követjük. Hát itt viccsen a közösségi elveket kell követni nyilván, csak most itt a, általában gondolom, hogy mi döntjük el, mi a helyes, vagy a társadalom. Szerintem inkább a társadalom, amiben élünk talán. Nagyon nehéz kérdés. Mennék a, mennék a közösséggel. Ah, you know, I think you'd find an ally in Herodotus, a scribe from among my people who lived some 400 years ago. He told the story of a man named Darius, whose curiosity was piqued when he learned that a certain tribe had the practice of eating their dead. He asked some Greeks who burnt their dead, what would it take for you to eat your dead? Aghast, they replied, Nothing. Then he asked the tribe who ate their dead, what would it take for you to burn your dead? Nothing, they replied, equally aghast. From this, Herodotus concluded that custom is king, that right and wrong are merely local ideas which do not survive the journey from one tribe to another. I take it you're in agreement? Then let me ask you this. If you visited a tribe where they ate each other, Copulated with the dead and drank wine from cups made out of human skulls, would you still maintain that within such a tribe there is nothing wrong with such conduct? Oh, felted a kereskedést. Hát nyilván anna az az hogy ott van egy probléma. Tehát, hogy ez rossz-e, azt én úgy gondolom, hogy ők döntik el. Tehát miért, miért én mondjam meg, hogy az ő törzsükben mi a rossz és mi a jó? Én egy, egy outsider vagyok, szóval... Hmm, disturbing. And while I do not agree with you, at least you would have the support of Herodotus. My point is this. I don't think anyone alive truly knows any hard and fast rules about right and wrong. Hát jó mondjuk, hogy ne üljünk meg senkit, engem. Surely you would agree there are circumstances where an exception may be made, such as where it is necessary for self-defense or to prevent a greater evil. For any rule, you can imagine there are countless situations in which that rule may be suspended, and those situations are impossible to codify. If there is hmm. one thing I have observed about rules, it is that virtuous people do not need them, 
and evil people will always find a way around them. And so we must accept our limitations and the sad truth that no human society will ever achieve the utopia for which it strives. In mathematics, we would call it an asymptote, a line that can be approached but never reached. Because the only way to create a utopia is with the ever-present threat of force, such as the Golden Rule. This and no other is the root from which a tyrant springs when he first appears as a protector. And life under tyranny is no utopia at all. That Alice her protector less. Megvéd minket mindentől. I'm glad to hear that. In any case, thank you for humoring an old man. I would be happy to answer your questions. Na, ez szuper. Közben le is maradtam, és más topsros rám is szólt, úgyhogy Sedit Adri köszönöm a 31-et, köszi szépen, és topsros köszönöm a 6-ot és a 9-et. Nagyon szépen köszönöm. Na. You mean how did I end up living alone in this cave with nothing but these relics of the past for company? It's a long story. I was a quarrelsome young man. At 19, I left Corinth for Rome to study rhetoric at one of her finest academies, so I could argue more forcefully. Back then, I used to enjoy verbally sparring with everyone I could, and I was good. One night, I found myself in a tavern in an argument with a drunken mercenary. It became heated, he drew a gladius, and I won the argument, but lost my life. I woke up on the banks of the Styx at a campfire opposite Karen. Of course, I tried to persuade her to let me return, but even with all my skill, I failed. Hmm. I settled in, made friends, and learned what I could, quickly realizing our little community faced certain death under the Golden Rule. So I began looking for a place to hide underground. Fortunately, I found this place waiting for me. You see, I was not the first to take refuge here. I returned to my friends above, persuaded them to join me, and 12 of us descended for the last time to live out our days hidden from Hades tyranny. Okay, that um vidat valamivel vidatkozott egy kocsmába és megölték. Önnek ennyi a sztoria alapvetően. They are one and the same. The Romans call him Pluto. But long before that, my people called him Hades. My generation was wiped out, turned to gold, many years ago. My friends and I were able to avoid the same fate by hiding down here. I think it's safest to assume that if I was to return, Hades would realize that his furies hadn't finished the job, and he'd send them after me again. I fear that if you were to utter my name in the city, even by mistake, that Hades would hear you and know I am still alive. Hmm. Then I'm not going to tell you who he is. I'm not going to tell you who he is. I'm not going to tell you who he is. I'm not going to tell you who he is. I'm afraid I am the only one left. There were twelve of us in the beginning, but one by one, my friends passed away. Some from malnutrition, others from madness and despair. It has been lonely. Before my unexpected visit from Kabash some weeks ago, I had not seen another person in many, many years. That nehen hete it was Kabash. Living in darkness is not without its challenges. The first challenge is diet. Fortunately, I found that eating fresh fish provides most of the nutrients I need. And sometimes, when there are Greek people living up above, I surface at night and salvage the offerings they've left in the temple of Demeter. The greater challenge is the isolation. So I like to imagine arguments where I argue both sides. Hmm. But, like so many things in life, arguments are better 
Az érdekes, hogy elképzeli a vitát. Az olyan, mint amikor magaddal sakkozol. Ugye az így fordigatod a táblát. Hát egyszer kipróbálom, így vitatkozok majd magammal. Mármint, hogy... Tudom, ez hülyé hangzik egy kicsit. Na mindegy, menjünk tovább. Kiutat nem tud, Golden Rule-ról mit gondol? Oké. Igen, azt keressük. Ah, Kabásnál van. I will tell you, but you may find him hostile. To prepare for your encounter, there are certain things you must know. Very few know this, but before the Romans came to this city, it was once entirely Greek. The architecture, the temples, and the people. When the Romans came, in typical fashion, they claimed it as their own, built over everything that could be built over, and renamed the things that could not. Thus, the shrine of Persephone became the shrine of Proserpina. And when they found an obelisk bearing the name Hades, they tore it off and replaced it with Pluto instead. And the city's dwindling Greek residents, witnessing this compulsive Roman conquest, decided to preserve what they could of their heritage. They gathered their art and valuables, secreted them away through the Temple of Demeter, and hid them here, out of reach of the Romans. Mm-hmm, okay. However, there was one thing that always seemed out of place to me, and it is the very thing you seek. An even older plaque bearing an Egyptian inscription. We had no idea until years later, when the first of my friends began to die. As a result of their deaths, we began to dig catacombs branching off from this cavern to lay them to rest. We extended the tunnel so far that we accidentally discovered another, an even older tunnel, which somebody had gone to great lengths to keep hidden. Suddenly it made sense why there was an out-of-place Egyptian plaque among our people's possessions. You see, we proud Greeks had thought the Romans beasts for stealing and corrupting our heritage. But it turns out this game has been going on much longer than any of us imagined. I think it is best you head through the catacombs and follow Kabash's trail. Okay. There are certain things you must see for yourself. Take this key. You need it to open the gate. Jó, megvan a kulcs. Oké. Akkor mehetünk is. I enjoyed our chat, but please keep my presence here a secret. Yes. Okvetlenül. Na, akkor irány a katakombák. Ha oda találunk, persze. Oké. Kövessük Kabást, vagy hát keresünk meg Kabást. Lehet, hogy ellenséges lesz, azt mondta ez a fickó, szóval... Hát nem tudom, mit kell tennünk. Majd. Ugye megölni nem nagyon lehet. Erre előveszem a íjat. Hmm. Hát én előveszem a fegyvert, csak az a baj, hogy nem lehet... Hát nem nagyon kéne, mert... Mondjuk legalább akkor lesz borunk, csak... Na, értitek. Ez mi volt? Uh... Shit! Oh. 
Nem a rossz, hí... rossz híjat vettem elő, mi? Ja. Jó, akkor itt kell lövöldözni majd egy kicsit. Na mindegy, menjünk tovább. Tovább. Csak a fejes. Hűha! Itt motoszkál valahol, csak nem látom. Na mindegy. Öm... Ja, nem baj, hogy kilátszik. Jobb látjátok a HP-t. Szenet. Szenet, ez a játék neve. Félelmetes hangok vannak. Nekem kéne kraftolni. Stop. Do not come any closer. Who are you? I am Kabash. Hmm. And let me guess. Another Greek or Roman come to loot and plunder the resting place of my ancestors. Hmm? That is. Hmm. Trousers, boots, curious hair. No, I suppose you do not. Then what do you want? Hmm, to what end? Hmm, that is welcome news. You really are not Greek or Roman, are you? I was planning to return it myself, but for now, I must remain. Here, take it and restore the honor of Osiris. Zsír. Meg is van. Now, as for the other plaque. Hmm. Tényleg a negyedik vele mi a helyzet. Indeed. I have it right here. Hát a... I stumbled across a collection of dusty curiosities while searching for a place to hide from the hungry children of Amit. And there it was. 
You may not. In fact, I am about to destroy it. Because it speaks a treacherous, blasphemous lie. I will tell you, but first, do you know what this place is? To do what? Indeed, and I see you know our history. This is the Duat. See what has become of it. I have been down here for weeks, piecing together its story. And here is what I have learned. As Egypt declined and the Greeks had their turn to flourish, their souls came here in great numbers. But instead of adopting our ways, they copied and corrupted them. When they found the obelisk bearing the name Osiris, the true god of the underworld, they desecrated it, removing his name and replacing it with <laughs> Hades. Even the ferryman of the dead, known to my people long before as Kerti, they renamed to Keron. As if that desecration was not enough, they built over this place using it as the foundation for their own underworld, so that ours was forgotten. Hmm, <laughs> my only solace is that the Greeks then suffered the same fate when the Romans rose to power, renaming Hades to Pluto, and the cycle began anew. It is inscribed with a script I do not recognize, but it is ancient, Almost as if it is older than the plaque bearing Osiris's name. But if that is so, it would imply the gods of Egypt are mere imitations too. Oh. Copied and corrupted from an ancient people who prospered even before us. And that my people hmm. did to them what the Greeks and Romans did to us. <laughs> but this uh, I cannot accept. <sighs> I sense a deception. Perhaps it is the work of Set, the usurper, seeking to undermine Osiris once more. Hát igen, azt hiszi, hogy vagy úgy gondolja, hogy az egyiptomi istenek, tehát az egyiptomiak is valahonnan lopták az istenek nevét, meg a úgy mindent, ugyanúgy mint ahogy a görögök az egyiptomiaktól, vagy a rómaiak a görögöktől. Um, You will never know. This work of sacrilege must be destroyed, thrown into the black abyss below in Osiris's name. You are too late. It is done. You would plunge into the depths of the Duat with no way back up. Madness. If it will help you to see reason, then ask. I do not know. What could possibly lie beneath the underworld? Perhaps it is infinite darkness. Perhaps it is the lair of Amit. The devourer of souls. Hmm. All I know hello, is hello, it would be unwise to venture down there. Is everyone so contrary where you are from? Do not even consider it. Good. Be gone from this place. Wait. You are planning to go down there. I see it in your eyes. You would plunge into the depths of the Duat with no way back up. Madness. Hmm, we shall see. Shumir. Most vagy ki kéne menni innen. Hmm. 
Hát, keresünk egy kiutat. Mi ez a nagy golyó? Szabad? Mennék. Oké. Tomb Raider intensifies. Azért kemények voltak, hogy fölgurították ezt a nagykövet. Ha, azt hittétek, hogy benézem mi? Mert merről jöhet a kő? told you that you would not find a way back up. That was not a prediction. That was a promise. You will die here. Hát te hülye vagy. I disagree. I warned you against coming down here. Against perpetuating this sacrilege. But you persisted. You have undermined and dishonored the true god of the underworld. How did you think this would end, if not with bloodshed? Very well, I will listen. But if I sense deception, or if you further insult my gods, I will carry out my threat. So tell me, why should I let you live after you salvaged this instrument of blasphemy? Amúgy mind a három jogos. De én ezt olyan filozófikusnak tartom. Then you admit it. You wish to destroy the sacred beliefs of my people. I will not allow this. Many of my ancestors endured great hardship to live good lives so that we may descend to the Duat in death and be judged accordingly. We prepare to have our hearts weighed on Anubis's scales and to swear ourselves innocent of sin before the 42 assessors of Ma'at. And yet I arrive here to find the Book of the Dead contained only a seed of truth. And now I ask myself, 
did our priests steal and embellish the stories of an older people and feed us lies all our lives simply to trick us into obedience? I am not sure I follow. Speak plainly. <laughs> hmm. Perhaps there is some truth in that. What is your point? Hát igen. Ugye ez csak tényleg az, hogy, hogy, a, hogy a vallás az, vagy hát a hit, vagy bármiben, amit, amiben hisznek, az, az ugye magunkból kell, hogy jöjjön, tehát magunkba uh, kell eldöntenünk mindent, nem, nem dogmák szerint élni. Hát igen. Hmm. You are persuasive. Very well. I will let you live, and you may do what you will with that plaque. I will remain here for a while and attempt to learn what I can about the foundations of my people's beliefs. Go. És lehet, hogy Kabásból most csináltunk régészt. Nem tudom, mi történt, de felszaladtam. Szóval itt tényleg az, az, hogy teljesen mindegy, hogy, hogy, hogy mi, mi volt, mi az igazság, hogyha magában jó életet élt, meg, meg olyan, tehát hogy tehát tényleg teljesen mindegy, hogy, hogy mi volt, hogyha tényleg ettől jó, jobb élete volt, akkor ö, nem hiszem, hogy ez sokat változtat. Ettől függetlenül még élhet jó életet. Na. Ö, oké, és szóval... Akkor még kéne a görög... És akkor gregorius kéne megtalálnunk. Öm, csak innen ki kéne találnunk először. You carry the gift of Prometheus in your hand. Remarkable. Igen, stop soros. Hát igen, azért néha nehéz úgy, úgy megtalálni, hogy, hogy, hogy mit is kéne mondani. Gregorius itt van fönt elvileg. Ah, a fellow traveler from a far away land. Georgius. Greetings, I'm Georgius. It gladdens me to see another foreigner in our midst. 
We must stick together, you and I. Vagy nem vele kell beszélni? My friend, your words intrigue me more and more. But yes, very well. Ask me what you will. And in a city full of Romans, you are asking me, because I am Greek. Let me tell you something about Greeks and Romans. My name is Georgios, yes. But the Romans, they do not care. They hear me say Georgios, and they think, ah, he must mean Georgius. Good Roman name. They do this all the time. They see us worshipping Zeus, they copy us, but call him Jupiter. They take Hades and call him Pluto, Persephone, Proserpina. I am flattered that they copy our ideas, but why must they change the names? Do they want credit for making it all up? Do they want to forget where it came from? At first, I pull my hair out. After a while, I give up, and I become Georgius the Roman. I accept the world is Roman now. Plus, I have no hair left to pull. But my point is this. If you want to know who stole an old Greek name, look no further than the sticky-fingered Romans. The plague you seek was pilfered from a collection of old Greek relics by none other than Dulli. He cannot help it. Like a typical Roman, he likes everything, especially those that once belonged to my people. And besides, it makes him happy. So I say, let him keep it. I believe he still has it with him, in his cell, just opposite the temple mm -hmm. of Demeter. Yo, okay. I hope that our paths cross again soon, my friend. My friend, d'accord. Uh... It's all up to you. Salve, Dooley. How are you doing today? I'm sad. Am I going to die in here? I don't think so, my friend. It's election day today. Perhaps our new magistrate will be kinder than Sentius and let you out. I hope so. Galerius, what happens when you die? You're not going to die. Most azon gondolkodok, Galerius lehetne a magistrát. Ő Galerius, ugye? My mother told me, when you die, a ferryman helps you cross a river, and your spirit lives on in the underworld. Is that true? Well, yes, but is it true that if you were good, you get to go to Elysium, but if you were bad, you get punished forever and ever in Tartarus? Something like that, but... What if I die and go to Tartarus, because they say I've been bad? I'm not going to let that happen to you, Dooley. I promise. Thank you, Galerius. Thank you. Now, I have more work to do, but I'll visit you again soon, alright? All right, Galerius. See you then. Na gyere. Beszéljünk. Szóval igen, friend. I went and did as you asked, and... It worked. How is it possible that you've just arrived here and you already know everyone and exactly what's about to happen to them? Oh, come on. I just did as you asked. The least you can do is level with me. I'll keep it between us, I promise. Uh, you're toying with me, right? Wait, you're not kidding, are you? That's the only way you could have known. You're a bit like... Oh, what was his name? Sisyphus. Yeah, that's the one. Old King Sisyphus. Sisyphus was a Greek king a long time ago. The daring... He was... Oh. Anyway, I don't so. Anytime, friend. Now, oh, and De Salve again, my Sisyphean friend. Now, what's on your mind? A vállasztás. I've bounced the idea around once or twice, 
mainly as a way of getting Dooley set free. God knows Sentius is never going to do it. But from what I hear, Maliolus has the election stitched up. Nobody's going to take him on and win. And maybe that's not such a bad thing. I mean, he talks a lot about freedom. So I'm hoping if he's elected, he'll release Dooley from his cell. That's good enough for me. And how could you... Oh, wait. You've seen it in another time loop, haven't you? Well, in that case, we need to find a way to make sure Maliolus loses. Better yet, get him to withdraw altogether. If you can do that, and Sentius is the only candidate left, I'll run against him. Deal? Na jó, jó. Oké, tehát hogyha... Ha... A Marcellus nem indul el, akkor Galerius elfog. És akkor valószínű leváltják Sentius-t, kiengedik Dulit, Uh, I can't see how I could vote for either candidate. I don't like Sentius much, but Maliolus is almost as bad. <laughs> Honda is Maliolus. Me, a farmer, and I've never given a speech or put on a toga in my life. Mio. All right, friend. Hope you find a way to break that cycle you're in. Na, lássuk, hogy mit tettünk még. Hát ez, ez majd a kövi körbe mehet, mert ugye bort most nem tudunk szerezni. A Greek Black az majd akkor, ha vissza tud lép, visszalép Marcellus, mert ugye akkor egy kiengedik Dulit a választás után. Oké. Mondjuk ott még lesz dolgunk a, a választások kapcsán. Hát, nagyon más nem tudunk most tenni. Esetleg még itt tudunk beszélni Equisával, aminek valószínűleg semmi értelme nem lesz, de... an impressive new face. Ave, and may Vesta watch over you. I'm Equitia. To what do I owe Equitia. visit? Okay. Uh, I beg your pardon? Oh my. That is quite a lot to take in. You'll have to give me a moment. Let's see. If that is indeed the case, I suppose we'd better figure out what to do about it. Hadn't we? We don't have much to go on, except the old stories. I remember four in particular about heroes in the underworld. Hercules, the demigod and son of Jupiter. Orpheus, a Thracian poet. Sisyphus, a king of Ephyra. And Aeneas, a Trojan yes. hero. Hercules was able to leave the underworld because yes, he found his god with his strength. Sisyphus and Orpheus both relied on their wits instead. They persuaded the goddess of the underworld, Proserpina, to help them escape. And finally, Aeneas was able to escape with the help of a spirit guide, who led him through a secret gate. So it seems you have two options. Yeah, there are as my man was here too. the underworld head on, or find a way to escape with the help of Proserpina or some other guide. May Fortuna guide you. De akkor mi ez a quest? Ave again. Did you find what you need? Hmm. Certainly. Igen, itt már mindent megbeszéltünk. Uh, jó, mindegy. Lehet, hogy akkor később lesz valami. Később lesz még valami. Akkor. Uh, ez folyamatban van. 
Hát ez is. Ezt még nem néztük meg. Apá. Jó, ez kell a bor. Ez kell duli. Na jó, hát esetleg még ezt a cisztent megnézhetjük, csak ez nem tudom hol van. Upper cistern. De mondjuk a kulcs is dulinál van. És akkor azzal se tudunk mit csinálni. Hát akkor... Don't believe a word they tell you. Salve. Hát jó, most nem jutott szembe, mint hogy előről kéne kezdenünk a napot. Mert gondolom még továbbra sem velünk szóba. Isn't that a big long bow? Oh, do us all a favor and drink hemlock, cap up murder. Hmm. Dagus. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. Köszi Stop Soros a százast. Gyere, Szentsősz, légy szíves. Kezdjük előről. Salve, friend. Mind telling me who you are and what you're doing with that bow on your back? Oh, sounds serious. I'm listening. Yulia. Oh no. All right, I can do that. Poor Virgil. Poor Rufius too, I guess. All right, got it. All right, let me see. Stop Fabia going in, but send the new arrival to the empty shrine. Understood. But how did you... All right, of course. I'll make sure this gets to him. I'll go. But once I'm done, I'll need you to tell me how you know all of this. Okay. Now, how many pains do we have? 5000. Mm. Szerezzünk még lóvét, csak hogy biztos elég legyen. Seri Tadri, köszönöm az újabb százast. Nagyon szépen köszönöm. Szerzünk még egy kis pénzt, és akkor elmegyünk a boré. How did you do? Hello there, friend. May I say? Well, I'll tell. Now you. Oh. All right. Wait, wait. Hmm. Here's your man now. Uh, I can't. You prom. What is this? I don't even. Yo, any pins like my saying them. Elég neki kéne lenni, hogy... Hogy, hogy működjön a dolog. Hmm. 
Wow, isn't that a big long bow? Oh, Sam. Ah, oh, you're here. I'm so glad you decided to visit. I'm Aurelia, and uh, I hope I'm not being too forward, but the moment I laid eyes on you, I was intrigued. There's a light in your eyes I've never seen before. A certain learning and sophistication. Well, since you bring that up, let's cut to the chase. What are you worth? Ten thousand? And you're just carrying that around? Oh my, aren't you impressive? But enough about that. I want to know all about you. Tell me, who are you hoping will win today's election? Sentius or Maliolus? Maliolus, nak a, um, yeah, you will make some. Maliolus, nak a barát nője. Hát, igen, szeretője. Hát akkor gondolom őt. Hmm, good answer. Though it's no secret that I'm a Maliolus supporter. So, tell me, what do you like about him? Hű. Come on, at least say it like you mean it, not because it's what you thought I wanted to hear. I take back what I said. Suddenly, I don't find you so intriguing anymore. Let's just forget that ever happened, so we can at least do business. So, what brings you to my tavern? I do, but... Well, even if you could get into my locked cabinet, and you can't, you'd be breaking the golden rule, wouldn't you, silly? Good idea. You had your one and only chance and you blew it. Time to move on. All right, see ya. That base let do it, them. I mean. And, uh, I hope I'm not being too forward, but the moment I laid eyes on you, I was intrigued. There's a light in your eyes I've never seen before. A certain learning and sophistication. Well, since you bring that up, let's cut to the chase. What are you worth? Ten thousand? And you're just carrying that around? Oh my, aren't you impressive? But enough about that. I want to know all about you. Because he stops at Tell me, who are you hoping will win today's election? Sentius or Maliolus? Hmm, good answer. Though it's no secret that I'm a Maliolus supporter. So, tell me. What do you like about him? Really? I say that to everyone I meet, and now you're just echoing it back to me? <sighs> I take back what I said. Suddenly, I don't find you so intriguing. All right. De akkor mi mondjam azt, hogy ki nem állhatom szentsőzt? Ok. 
Come on. At least say it like you mean it. Not because it's Let's... me off. All right. De az a baj, hogy alternatívát sem nagyon ad a játék, mert utána meg már, hogy veszem el a bort. I'm beginning to think Venus herself sent you to me because I love the way you think. Let's see it in Julia. Here's an idea. How about we head to the baths with some wine I've been saving and see where it leads? Oh. I see you know how to treat a lady. Ask me what lads. What? What are you talking about? No, no, you give that back. Give it back, or, or you'll break the golden rule. Hát te adtad oda. Only so you could carry it to the baths. Think you're clever, do you? Well, you're nothing but a a phony career. Class bezony. I'm just gonna use you for your money. Hát akkor valószínűleg nem fog fürdeni. Cerberus lifts his triple head. And lets out his breath. Delegate, I'm going to bore. We are going to go to the Marcellus Bezard Felesége. Is it that you can't get a board? Julia, citizen, citizen. Hát igen, a kövi lúpig fog utálni. Nem történt semmi. Citizen. How come you're allowed a weapon and I'm not? I'm not supposed to be in here. De hoztam bort. Talk. What business could you possibly have with me? You barge into my villa and offer me wine. I'd have you thrown out, but it just so happens that is exactly what I need. The question is, what do you want for it? Ah, it seems Bacchus smiles on me once again. And I believe I had just okay. the thing you're looking for. Some time ago, he wrote me a letter and signed it Quinctius, apparently by accident. I've kept it ever since, hoping one day I'd find out what it meant. I'll happily show it to you for that wine. Tashi. Thank you. Here's the letter. Now, perhaps you can tell me who Quinctius really is. Oh, 
Ó, oh, és akkor ő, ő kezdte, a, tehát ő volt a római tűz okozója. What? He's... Oh no, that's... Um, quite a lot more serious than I imagined. I only wanted some leverage over him, not to destroy him. Give me that immediately. Nobody else must know. What? No. You... you tricked me, you mendacious little Sturkus. I curse you. I curse your life and mind and memory. Oh. May you be unable to walk or eat or drink. May this drag you to the depths. This is outrageous. Savas. Menjünk akkor. És megmondjuk uh, Marcellusnak, hogy ő bizony ma nem indul a választásokon. Demetrius doesn't usually let anyone in here without a heft. <laughs> Are you insane? You barge into my villa uninvited and then make outrageous demands? As on you. Why would I withdraw from an election I'm bound to win? I... Uh, so, it finally caught up with me. I suppose that makes you, what, one of Nero's assassins? So, you're not going to kill me? Hát mondjuk ezt már megoldottuk. Szóval ezzel én különösebben nem foglalkoznék ez a dept, tehát az, hogy tartoznak nek, vagy a... Igen, igen, igen. Szóval csak lépjen vissza. So much work for nothing. If I do it, you'll let me live? Fine. Ruling this cesspit of a city would have been beneath me anyway. I'll have Demetrius notify the priestess of my withdrawal. There. You got what you wanted. Now, please, leave my villa and never speak to me again. Okay. Super. Um, igazi pszichopata, mert még ezt is uh, győzelemként értékelte. Okay. Uh, beszélnünk kéne szerintem... Um, Galériusszal. Hogy akkor most ő induljon el. Szenses helyet, csak hol van Galérius? Are you listening? Yes, sir. I've made a decision to withdraw from the election. I want you to go and inform Equitia. Sir? Are you under duress, sir? I, I just had a, a, a change of heart. Are you on track to be magistrate, sir? All that work. All that money wasted. Those are my orders. Carry them out. <sighs> As you wish, sir. Yo. The whole one. Whole one, Galerius. Don't believe a word they tell you. Let me do do live our best again. Hát megnézzük. Nem, nincs itt. Vagy még nincs itt. Hmm. És ki se, ki se teszi a... a márkert. Citizens, I have an announcement. Maliolus has withdrawn his candidacy from today's election. Unless any new challengers are nominated by nightfall, Sentius will be re-elected magistrate by default. That is all. Oké, 
Hogy mit mondott Galliolus a legelső lukban az elején? Uh, nem. Az a baj. Hol lehet? Fú, erre nem emlékszem, hogy mivel foglalkozik. Próbálok emlékezni, de... Nem, nem, nem fog eszembe jutni, sajnos. Dolgozik, de hol, hol dolgozik? De nem, nincs uh, citizen lista. Ja, mondjuk az van. Még ez okos gondolat. Farmer. A szalám valakik. Hát de farmer. Itt nincsen kis földek. Again, friend, I went and did as you asked, and it worked. How is it possible that you've just arrived here and you're a form of Shemmy Bull? And exactly what's about to happen to them? Oh, uh, of course, I'll leave you to it then. Um, I saw you slide down that rope before. Very impressive. Letting the mess cat one among them. Strange too, since that device you used is exactly the same as one I've been working on for weeks. There I was thinking I'd invented it. Anyway, I'm sorry to ask, but is there any chance you'd be willing to do me a favor? No, we can. I've been trying to get this rare flower from the rock spire in the middle of the lake. It's too steep to climb, so I hung a rope over the lake and made this pulley device. Only I uh, couldn't quite summon the nerve to use it. Do you think you could use the device again and try to get that flower for me? Oh, thank you. It would help me a lot. There's no rush, just whenever you get a chance. I've bounced the idea around once or twice, mainly as a way of getting Dooley set free. God knows Sentius is never going to do it. But from what I hear, Maliolus has the election stitched up. Nobody's going to take him on and win. And maybe that's not such a bad thing. I mean, he talks a lot about freedom. So I'm hoping if he's elected, he'll release Dooley from his cell. That's good enough for me. He did? Oh, that was unexpected. I wonder what could have possessed him to do that. Well, I guess it's time for me to step up then. I'll let Equitia know I'll be running. Oké, okay. na, ennek örömére milyen tó közepén lévő azt a virágot kéne megszerezni neki? Hát de... Hogy? Na várjatok. tudunk úgy ugrani köz, menet közbe, vagy nem a nagy perec lesz, szerintem. Fölmászni tuti nem tudunk. Use the gold, de... Na várjatok. Ha. 
Ha. Hát igen, mondjuk. Közel volt. Na, tehát ö, azt nem tudom, hogy kell. Nop. Igen, itt kimászni nem tudunk, akkor ö, igen, hogy le kell ugrani. Mármint, hogy... Na, még egyszer megpróbálom. Aztán hallása, nem is tudom, hogy, hogy mi lesz a következő tennivaló. Elég jól haladunk. Insane skills, csak mondom. Na, viszünk neki virágot is. It's you again. Hope you're settling in, friend. Oh, and I'm in the running for magistrate. Feeling kind of nervous, but I'm hoping it'll all be worth it when I order Dooley's release. I just hope I'll have the votes I need. Now, what's on your mind? Brilliant! You did it! Well done! This is going to make her so happy. Equitia, I mean. Ooh. Now I just have to figure out how to give it to her. Equity. What I really want to do is walk up to her, give her the flower, and confess I've been madly in love with her since the moment we met. But on the other hand, I can't shake the feeling that the consequences could be terrible. <sighs> Aside from her execution? You see, Equity is a vestal priestess, meaning she's taken a vow of chastity. The breaking oh. would be an extremely serious affront to the gods and a capital offense. Even if she was just suspected of being unchaste, it could lead to her execution. Unchaste Vestals get buried alive. Oh, and I'd get flogged to death for good measure. But at the same time, she's just so kind and graceful. I feel so much love for her that if I don't tell her, it'll burn a hole in my chest. I don't know what to do. What do you think? What would you do? Hát, a legőszintébb válaszom ez lenne. Hát, mi majd Lex még, még egy loop lesz ezt a nagy ügy. Hmm. Now that I hear you say that out loud, I hear how crazy it is. I think maybe I need to be a bit more cautious. What I need is a go-between. Someone who can tell her how I feel and find out how she feels without risking her life. Igen, hát. What do you say? Do you think you could help me one more time? Egyeteműen egy egy góbit vére pályázik mindenki. Wonderful. Now all I need you to do is give her the flower and tell her it's from a secret admirer. Tell her I'll keep my distance and that I just want her to know that she's loved. Thank you. Come back as quick as you can and tell me what she says. Hát jó. Akkor megnézzük ezt. De most milyen kerítőt játszunk amúgy? Vagy, vagy mi ez? Never mind. Hello? A new face. Ave, and may Vesta watch over you. I met Quitia. To what do I owe the pleasure of this visit? Oh, how lovely. It just happens to be my favorite, too. 
Who do I have to thank for this? I see. So, it's from Galerius, then? Of course I do. I think everyone in the city knows. That man is a wonderful human being, and my favorite person in the world. But he is the least subtle secret admirer you could imagine. The way he looks at me with those puppy dog eyes. Plus, he's been trying for weeks to get his hands on this flower. He went to so much effort, too, suspending that rope above the lake, inventing that pulley device all on his own. He'd just stand there each morning, looking at the flower, trying to summon the courage to seize it. Oh, my heart. Tell that adorable oak that my Vestal's vow of chastity ends once I turn 36. So, if we ever make it out of here, and he doesn't mind waiting a few years, then tell him I love him too. Oh, I hope so. És ennyi. See you again soon, I hope. Na jó. Elmondjuk nekik a, neki a jó hírt. Már ha ez jó hír, hogy 36 éves koráig várni kell. Ah, it's you again. Hope you're settling in, friend. Now, what's on your mind? Thanks. What did she say? Venus, that is the best news I've ever heard in my life. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. You have no idea how happy you've made me. I wish there was something I could do to thank you properly, but I don't have much to offer you. All I can do is tell you where there's a secret stash of coins you might be interested in. In the rock tunnel near the stairs, there's a little doorway set into the rock. Inside, if you look carefully, you can see a chest. Unfortunately, one of those golden huntress statues is blocking the path, and I'm not game to move it. If you can figure out how to get past it, I reckon there might be a small fortune waiting for you. I hope that helps in some way. All right. See you around. De azt nem felvettük már. Lehet, hogy azt már kifosztottuk korábban, mint ha már voltunk, lettünk, jártunk volna arra. Na mi van még itt? Um, figure out how to get Galerius elected. Oké, okay, tehát akkor beszélnünk kell a emberekkel a szavazásról. Um, a Greek tábla ez uh, Dulinában. Dulinában ez a kulcs is. Ezt fogalmam sincs, hogy itt mit kell csinálni. Oké, okay, ez megint csak a, a táblák. Oké, okay, itt a Golden Rule kapcsán van még mindig, ugye? Jó, hát akkor ö, most meg kéne győzni az embereket, hogy Galiusra szavazzanak, vagy kire. Mert... Ö, bár lassan már nincs kit... Ö, nem, nem sok mindenkivel vagyunk olyan jóban. Hát mondjuk te. What is it, citizen? Not that it's any of your business. But my loyalty is hát, and always will be with Sam. Igen, ezt mondjuk nem fogjuk tudni szerintem meggyőzni. All right. Rá, ránk se nézett. Arra nem emlékszem, hogy ki volt, aki... De várj, meg kell egyáltalán valaki győznem. Na mindegy, beszélgetek azért emberekkel, de nekem úgy rémlik, hogy simán mindenki... Vagy eleve többen szavaztak uh, Marcellusra, mint Sanchezre. Galerius. Galerius? Ja igen, mert mi... Ó, oké, oké, oké. But of course. I hope that our paths cross again soon, my friend. Aha. Tehát Galerius most 
gyakorlatilag mindenkinek segített, tehát lehet, hogy igazából semmit nem kéne csinálnom. Ah, a new face. Salve, and welcome to all. I hear we have you to thank for saving Julia's life. I'm glad you arrived when you did. Galerius, definitely. He put an end to the notes and graffiti I've been receiving. All right. Oké, okay. tehát az is az, ezért, mert segítettünk. Hú, nem is emlékszem, hogy ebbe a körbe lehúztuk uh, Tézius-t. Oké. Okay. Jó, még benézünk ide. Elvi... Hol van a... a healer? Hello, Lucrezia. De nem is szavazhat. Feeling all right? That's a shame. Thanks again for saving Julia's life. Apollo smiles upon you. Na, ki szavazhat még? <laughs> Wakanda forever, így van. Um, hát... Kidobó szerintem, hát nem tudom. What now? <laughs> I'm not going. Whatever. Just remember. Tehát ő nem fog szavazni. Hát ki van még? Még van a Rufius, vagy hogy hívják? Ruf Ruf Citizen. Ez valahol itt lesz. Nem, nem itt van. Akinek van a... Mondjátok már, reumája. Rufius, igen. De mondjuk rajta is segített Gladius. Vagy hogy, hogy hívják. Szóval... Lehet, hogy különösebben őt se kéne meggyőzni. Meg nem is tudom, hogy hol van. Még esetleg megkereshetném a... Júliának a fasziát. Nem tudom, hogy hívják. A Ulpius, igen. Hát, ha ő itt lesz valahol. Igen, igen, Ulpius jöjjön. De itt csak ezek vannak. Még meg úgy se szavazhatnak. Nem, itt, itt tényleg nincs. Na, na jó, bár... Bár ugye Ulpius is segít, Ulpiuson is segített, szóval... Lehet, hogy azzal se kéne különösebben győzködni. Hát itt meg nincs senki. Ja, erre senki nincs. Jó, hát nem is tudom, hogy tudunk-e valamit csinálni most. Ezen gondolkodok. Hát még esetleg ezt tudjuk most megnézni. De többit azt nem. Csak ez meg fogalmam sincs, hogy hol van. Valahol oda kéne fölmenni. Na egy erre még nem is voltunk egyébként bármilyen furcsa. Körülnézünk. Ez meg... 
Oh, what was this? Enemy top. Oh, okay. Your menu get full. Lehet, hogy ezt mondta a fickó, ez a coin pouch. Na mindegy, jöjjünk még itt tovább. De ide csak átjövünk a palotához. Viszont akkor nem erre kell jönni. Hol van ez a cistern? Lehet, hogy lent lenne. Várjatok csak. Itt voltunk már egyébként? Lehet, hogy jaj, de be se tudunk jönni, ugye? Great Temple Do. Ja, igen, mert nincs kulcsuk, ugye ezt mondta a nő, hogy ide nem tudunk bejutni. Hmm. Hát igen, ez jó lenne, hogy ezt a cisztent tudni, hogy hol, hol van. Hello. Salve. Erre se voltunk. Ja, de voltunk már, nem? Szerintem voltunk erre is. Ó. Oh. Lehet, hogy ez, a, ez van Dalinak, Dulinak kulcsa. Na mindegy. Ö, megnézzük majd. Megvárjuk. Jó. Oktáviával nem tudom most beszélni, ugye? Vagy... Nem, szerintem őről nem nagyon, nem nagyon kell miről beszélni. Nem. Friend? Itt nem tudunk lecsúszni. Hát akkor nem nagyon tudunk most szerintem mit csinálni. Azon kívül, hogy megvárjuk, hogy, hogy megtörténjen a választás. De se tudunk bejönni, ugye, mert itt van a névia. Igen, néviával meg már foglalkoztunk. Hmm. Onnan ki, ki lehetett jönni, azt hiszem. Nem is tudom. Hát nem tudom. Ö, tényleg nem tudom akkor, hogy mit lehetne még tenni. Most azon kívül, hogy várunk. Erre még nem voltunk, szerintem. Ö, 
Um, ez a budi. Nem kell várni. Um, előre lehet pörgetni? Valahogy. Nem tudom. Nem, mert... Uh... Aha. Hát a menni sellel az a baj, hogy akkor előről indul megint. Csak nem tudom, hogy lehet előre pörgetni. Salve. Kérdezzem meg a releváns embereket. Ah, it's you again. Hope you're settling in, friend. Now, what's on your mind? Ah, oh, csajt. Vagy a nőd. Ha megtalálom. Még mindig elkobászolnak valahova. Lehet mondjuk csak hazament. again did you find what you need it must be completed by dusk just the same as any other official business it'll be between sentius the incumbent and galerius the challenger why do you ask as i said i'm planning to hold it before dusk but i suppose i could hold it sooner if there's a good reason Hmm. Yes. I have overheard some rather unpleasant arguments. The last thing we need here is additional conflict. Very well. I'll get things started right away. Zsír. Az ennyi nem kell sietni. Szalad. Na hát kíváncsi vagyok. Citizens, it is time. Let us meet to elect our magistrate. Time to go to the theater. Csak akkor most, hát meglátjuk, hogy megválasztják el, remélem, ha nem, akkor meg figyelni kéne, hogy ki az, aki rá szavaz, vagy ki az, aki a sensus szavaz, és megpróbálni meggyőzni majd a kövi körbe. De szerintem mindenki rá fog szavazni. Hát őt nem vagyok benne biztos, de a többiek igen. Hát, még talán a reumás is. Egyedül a horés ez nem. Ugye, aki hűszolgálója. Ő. Ő biztos nem... nem tehát ő biztos, hogy Sanchez-re fog szavazni. 
De mindjárt kiderül. Citizens, we have a quorate body of voters gathered here to elect the city's magistrate. The candidates are Sextus Sentius Imperiosus and late nominee Gallus Galerius Helva. Marcus Maliolus Gerges withdrew his candidacy earlier today. As agreed, we shall dispense with ballots and candidates will abstain from voting. Let's make this quick. As I say your name, call your vote. I'll start with you, Horatius. Sentius, of course. Georgius. Galerius. He saved the life of my dear friend Fabia. Dacius. Sentius. Virgil. The man who put a stop to the threats I've been receiving. Galerius. Ulpius. Galerius, the man who saved my life. Rufius. The man who treated my rheumatism. Galerius. Citizens, you have made your decision. Your new magistrate is Gallus Galerius Helva. What? It has been decided. Magistrate Galerius, would you like to make a brief address? Uh... I just want to say, this isn't something I ever wanted. Now that you've put your trust in me, I'm going to do everything I can not to let you down. I'll need some time to put together a list of the changes I want to make around here. But I promise you, there will be changes. My first order is that Dooley is to be freed. Horatius, release him from his cell immediately. Please. Wait, do I need to say please? I suppose not. That's it. You can all get on with your day. Nothing else to see here. Move along. Hogy elszaladt? Jó, na akkor irány Duli. Szuper megválasztották. Ja, kezdődik a mi kis falunk kívül. Fortune smiles on you today, Julius. Magistrate Galerius here has ordered your release. You're going to let me out of here? I'm sorry it took so long, my friend. And it wouldn't have happened at all if it wasn't for a newcomer. So be sure to offer your thanks when you can. I will. I will. Thank you, Galerius. I'm so happy. Na, kéne a tábla, meg a kulcs. I've got a lot of work ahead of me. Why don't you go to the baths? Then tell Georges I said you could have some new clothes. Then I want you to go home and rest. I'll speak with you soon, Dooley. Uh, hello? I'm Dooley. Magistrate Galerius said I should thank the newcomer. Are you the newcomer? Oh. It is you. Then, thank you. You're a big helper. I was locked up, but they let me out again. I'm so happy. Nice. You can have my shiny plaque if you want, and maybe you can help me find my treasure. My friend Hannibal used to look after me, and he said he always would. But then he died. But before that, he told me, if anything ever happened to him, I had to find something very precious. He gave me a key to the cisterns and told me to keep it safe. He said there's oh, cool. something very precious way up high. Way up high. I had to keep it a secret until I found someone I could trust. Okay. Oh, thank you. Na, megvan a tábla, megvan a kulcs. Kösz minden duli. Hát, lopni nem kéne, de na mindegy, menjünk. Over the rainbow, így van. És köszönöm szépen az ötöst. 
Stop Sős, te köszönöm a támogatást. Jó. Find the Greek Black. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. De megvan a kulcs, az biztos. Um, úgyhogy ezt tudjuk használni. Azt még most mindenképp megnézzük. All right, let me see. Stop Fabia going in, but send the new arrival to the empty shrine. Understood. As a wee. What? Are you? You're serious, aren't you? I doubt Demetrius will let me talk to him, but I'll make sure he passes on the message. I'll go, but once I'm done, I'll need you to tell me how you know all of this. És ott a virág. Hmm. Jó, akkor uh, szerintem nézzük meg ezt a... Hogy az a kulcs, amit adott nekünk Dani, az oda való el, hova... Nem erre, nem erre. Ahova gondolom. Most szerintem mást amúgy se kellene csinálnunk. Csak oda bemenni. Körbeszaladunk mindent. Majd kiderül, hogy nem is ide kell a kulcs. Jó. Sedit Adri, köszönöm szépen a százast. Um, Sentila. I found a way out through the gate of horn, but it's locked. So I told him about it, and instead of helping me escape, he locked me up. He wants to keep us all here forever, or until we're turned to gold. He's a monster. You have to let me go so we can kill him and take his key. The key to the. Sentius. My adopted father. Furies help me. I'll castrate and crucify him. I don't 
don't know. He said the gods are on his side because they don't want us to escape either. That of Fateria thought you'd fall. Behind me, there's an aqueduct tunnel bringing water from outside the city, so it should lead us outside. The only problem is it's barred by a heavy locked gate, and he has the only key. I'm going to take that key from around his neck, even if it means cutting his throat to get it. I'm done caring about the golden rule. I just want out. Help me, and we can escape together. There won't be enough time. Just you and me. What do you say? Hmm. Hát erre kíváncsi vagyok. Oh, thank you. Now follow. Wait. Did you hear that? He's here. He must be coming in through the door behind me. You distract him. Stay right here and keep him talking while I look for something I can use. Oh. What did you do with Centilla? Where is she? So that is how it's going to be. Oh well, this doesn't change anything for me. It's a shame, really. If you'd just done what you were supposed to, you'd have been looping through time forever until you gave up and killed yourself. Just like that soft-hearted pleb, Al. Me? Yo, Al, aki először jött. De arra, hogy emlékszik? Surely you didn't think you were the only one here who remembered everything. Oh, okay. My connection to that is probable. That preserves my memories from one. Whether that was Proserpina's intention or a happy accident, oh, that you emlékszik rá. But I'm surprised you hadn't noticed. Here I was thinking you're a little bit sharper than Al was, or perhaps you're just more willing to break the rules. He was a moralistic fellow, never once compromised on his principles, and because of that fatal flaw, he relived this day many thousands of times before we finally had this. I watched him come through the portal each time. Always a little older, a little more dishevelled, a little more haunted. And when he finally saw the futility of it all, as you're about to, it broke him. He drank a jug of wine, tied a noose around his neck, and took his own life. Just before he was shot with a golden arrow. The next time I awoke, you showed up, but you—you've caught up to where he was so quickly. I'd have preferred if you'd given me more time to enjoy the trappings of my success. How many extra days did you give me? Just the eight? Not a lot compared with Al, but I've seized every day, nonetheless. In any case, there's no escape for you except the path that Al took, the path he wrote about on his tablet. What was it? Ah, yes. Better to end it all now than find out what awaits you beyond that portal. So you discovered my secret. So what? What are you going to do about it? Okay. Of course. There's no way you could have succeeded. Every soul who has ever found themselves here has broken the golden rule eventually. It is inevitable. Man will always sin sooner or later. Any idiot could tell you this. But where others might see tragedy, I saw opportunity. As I told you the first time we met, I found a way to cheat death. By reliving the same day over and over again forever. And I will continue living. Long after your dust. Why? Isn't it obvious? 
because I have grown attached to all this. My title, my beautiful villa, the sun on my face, the music of birds chirping. And as long as this day keeps repeating itself, I get to enjoy it all, over and over again, for eternity. Don't you see? I have found a way to prolong my life indefinitely, to cheat death. I have become, in effect, as immortal as the gods. Can you honestly say you would not wish the same for yourself? <laughs> Do you really think you can take on a Decurion with that flimsy little bow? Who? Centilla? Where is she? I'm right here, father. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. to you that light it it's so bright okay oh uh, hi there gave me a bit of a fray thought I was in here alone I'm Al. Well, here I am. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. Really? That's strange. I was just reading an old tablet I found here. Well, trying. My Latin is kind of rusty, but the last entry mentioned someone with the same name. It described an event about 2,000 years ago. Someone with your name appeared in the city out of the shrine of Proserpina. Freed an imprisoned woman named Santilla, who then murdered her captor, breaking some kind of ancient law. It said the attack caused golden statues to come alive, hunting down everyone in the city and turning them into gold. Apparently, the only person to survive was Santilla, while the stranger disappeared in a flash of light. Huh. Uh, what? You're saying you were here 2,000 years ago. I... I'm not sure I understand. Uh, I'm sorry, come again? Um, let me see that. God, why does this writing look so familiar? I've spent a lifetime in this place going around and around in circles. This is... Uh, this is disturbing. But I don't understand how I could have written it. I... Uh, I'm not following. Okay. Igen, tehát segítettünk Szentillának megölni azt az embert, aki kinyitotta ezt a time portalt, és, és visszavitte az időben. És így akkor soha nem fog megtörténni. So you're saying, because a man from 2000 years ago is dead, he never created a time portal, so I never went through it, and that's why I don't remember any of this. I guess you saved my life then, as well as helping that poor woman to escape. That's a lot to take in. Yo, what you doing here? Through the same aqueduct Santilla used, if we can find it. Okay. Yo, that wall. It less. Okay. Visszafolyóhoz. Uh, I'm gonna pause here for a moment and make sure nobody else is ever lured into this temple. You go on ahead, and I'll be there soon. Hát jó. Menjünk.
Oh. You're back. But you're alone. Does that mean you didn't find Al? Oh, what a relief. Thank you so much. I was beginning to think you'd both become trapped in there. Why don't you tell me what you discovered while we wait? Sembeshichuk. Nem merem. Really? Sounds amazing. And did you Oh, look. Here he comes. Ow! It's so good to see you. You were gone so long I thought I'd never see you again. Kind of lost track of time in there. You wouldn't believe what we found. The ruins of a long forgotten city. And there was a tablet describing an event 2000 years ago. Supposedly the city was destroyed when a woman murdered a tyrant with the help of well, my new friend here. I know how crazy that sounds. Maybe not that crazy. That woman. I don't suppose her name was Centella? How could you what? She left a tablet of her own. I stumbled across it while I was waiting here. Mm -hmm. I think she meant for you to read it. Here, take a look. Centella? I don't know what became of you, or if you'll ever read this. But I want you to know that I will never forget you, or what you did for me. It pains me that so many dear friends were not so fortunate. Ulpius, Centia, Lucretia, Horatius, Galerius, or Dooley, and the others. But please understand, their blood is on my hands, not yours. I will live with the consequences of my actions. And all I can do is move forward, trying to show others the same compassion you showed me. I promise you that saving my life will not be for nothing. Centilla. Hmm. Sounds like you meant a lot to her. I'd love to hear your story, but first, you two look exhausted. Why don't you hop in my boat and rest while I... Ferry you back to civilization. Sounds good to me. Huh. And you? Are you ready to go home? Okay. Yo, that is a ending. Is a crazy to look much while I'm in Kesdani? Na hát, euh, akkor véget is ért. Uh, fú, egy ending megvan. Így van, így van, így van. Uh, van még három másik. De hát végig, végig ment. Uh, érdekes egyébként, mert a végén nem volt különösebben nagy uh, olyan... Igen, a main endinghez is közel voltam, aha, aha. Hát mindegy, így alakult. Gondolom olyat is lehetett volna, hogy megmentek mindenkit, vagy, vagy sokakat. Mindegy, így sikerült. Így sikerült a dolog. Na, úgyhogy, hát tényleg egy, egy szuper játék. És akkor itt vannak a szereplők. Ugye a... voice acting, tehát a szinkron színészek, ami szerintem nagyon jó volt egyébként. Olyan sokat nem kellett azért színészkedni, de, de szerintem nagyon jó volt. És egyébként Adri, köszönöm szépen a 150-et, nagyon szépen köszönöm a támogatást. Na, szóval e, tényleg e, egy, egy nagyon jó kis játék, ahhoz képest, hogy hárman fejlesztették, azért látszik, hogy többen is dolgoztak e, ezen, mert hát Azért, azért nyilván itt a szinkron színészek azért ott voltak. Um, na mindegy, szóval tényleg egy, egy nagyon jó játék, és azért, azért kellett agyalni, hogy most akkor hova, merre, és még, és még nem is a, a main endinget csináltuk meg. Hát na mindegy. Uh, én, én mindig azért szeretem ezeket a játékokat, mert mutatja azt, hogy, hogy tényleg... Uh, nem kell ide több száz, több ezer fejlesztő, hogy egy élvezetes jó játék szülessen meg. 
szerintem ennek a játéknak a végigjátszása időben nem volt kevesebb mondjuk nekem, mint mondjuk egy, egy, egy Wolfenstein játéknak, főleg a mostaniaknak, ugye az elmúlt tíz évet mondom körülbelül. Na mindegy, szóval szerintem szuper volt. Ugye amit érdekes, hogy nyilván a világ, hogy fölépült, tehát maga a hely, ahol voltunk, szerintem nagyon szép volt, jó, jól nézett ki. Nem azt mondom, hogy olyan elképesztő aprólékos volt, de, de szépen megalkották, tehát nagyon jól nézett ki. Ugye a, hát a karaktermodellek azok olyanok, amilyenek. Nyilván ma már azért vannak ennél jobb, jobbak is, de szerintem a maximumot kioszták, amit, amit ki lehet. Ami ilyen, amilyen érdekes lehet még, nem tudom, hogy gondolom itt azért nem arról volt szó, hogy, hogy fölvették ezeket, tehát rendesen ilyen mokeppel, meg ilyesmi, hanem szerintem ilyen generált valami karaktermodellek voltak, még az is lehet, hogy olyan, ami eleve benne van az engine-be. Én ami, amit nézegettem mostanában, hogy az Nvidia-nak van egyre több ilyen ö, alkalmazása, ugye az Nvidia-nak ez az Omniverz ö, ö, alkalmazásába, ami tényleg olyan, hogy, hogy, ö, hogy elképesztően jó voice actinget ad, ö, és tehát a voice actinget is ugye adja ugye a, a generált hanggal, illetve a ami mondjuk egy kicsit robotos, persze, illetve arcmozgást, mimikát, minden nagyon-nagyon jól e, tud. Hát tényleg összekombinálni egy olyannal, mondjuk az szerintem kicsit, kicsit költségvetésbe több, többet is jelentene, de tényleg az, az már abszolút realisztikus lenne. Aztán az, hogy pár év múlva hogy fognak ezek a, ezek a karaktermodollek kinézni, így gémbe, hát bele sem merek gondolni. Ha valaki esetleg e, tudja nézni például a, a Book of Boba Fettet, hogy én, én nem nagyon tudom így most e, hova tenni, hogy tényleg a, a kvázi 30 évvel ezelőtti Luke Skywalker-t látjuk, és nem tudom megmond, nem tudnám meg, csak azért tudom megmondani, hogy ez nem ő, mert tudom, hogy ő nem ennyi idős. Tehát, na mindegy, ha esetleg valaki nézi, e, az, az tudja, mire gondolok, aki meg nem az, hát, ha teheti nézzel rá. Na mindegy, ö, szóval tényleg egy nagyon jó játék volt, ö, és ezen fogunk most bosszankodni, hogy, 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 hogy a, a main ending hogyan, hogyan jöhetett volna létre. Na mindegy, de így is szerintem szuper volt. Ö, szerintem én ezt most elnyomom, be tudom tölteni? Hát jó, csak... Hát nem ma este, az biztos. Um, meg majd lehet, hogy utána nézek egy kicsit, mert... Na mindegy, meglátjuk, meglátjuk. Na, minden esetre ez volt a Forgotten City. Uh, nem kizárt, hogy megnézzük majd a alternatív endinget is, vagy a main endinget pontosabban. Üm... Igen, igen, azért is gondolnám, mert, mert uh, nem volt rossz ez az ending, csak olyan... Oké. Okay. Um, és itt írja is, hogy a Beyond the White Hallway. És uh, nem voltunk White Hallway-ben. Na mindegy. Uh, első ending is vicces, sűrű a menetrend. Igen, viszont uh, szerintem bele fog félni, vagy hát majd meglátjuk. Lehalkítom egy kicsit ezt az epic zenét. Um, mára viszont tényleg megállunk, um, és akkor szerintem holnap este lesz egy kis stream. Uh, hát, hogy mennyi, azt majd meglátjuk. Um, ugye a holnapi meg a szombati is a menetrendbe kérdőjellel van, de akkor szerintem holnap lesz pénteken. 
holnap péntek, mármint hogy ma már péntek, igen, tehát este lesz, péntek este lesz, akkor stream, God of War-ozunk, megpróbáljuk megint, és hogyha időbe sikerül, akkor lehet, hogy visszatérünk erre. És akkor megnézzük a, a többi endinget, meg megpróbáljuk akkor a main endinget behozni, hogy, hogy, hogy meg legyen. Lehet, hogy kicsit utána fogok olvasni, de az azért veszélyes, mert akkor meg spoiler. Na mindegy, majd, majd agyalok rajta, hogy hogyan lehetett volna a main endinget kihozni, illetve esetleg stop soros segít, ha itt lesz. Na, úgyhogy holnap este folytatjuk. Mm. Mármint, hogy holnap este stream, ha időbe végzünk Szigrunnal, akkor jövünk ide, ha nem, akkor meg majd lehet, hogy egy kicsit, kicsit később. Oké, okay, stop soros, köszi szépen. Na, én nagyon szépen köszönöm a followokat, szubokat, csíreket, donéteket, de legfőképpen azt, hogy itt voltatok és néztétek. Találkozzunk holnap, addig is további szép estét kívánok nektek, legyetek jók! Sziasztok!